Another DC is not the end of the world. It does kind of suck for my VODs, but it's okay. Okay, we're back. Good. Great. Fantastic. Fantastico. Hello, hello. I'm so sorry. Uh, that's on me. I didn't do a stress test. I should have um, posted, posted. I should have done um, at least some of my dailies earlier to knock out some of the disconnection issues, but I didn't do that. So hopefully that's the only one that we get. If I DC again, do not fear. Just hang out and I'll come back. All right. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Someone remind Vlad to come and um, replace my modem. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let me fix my, my hair back here. Are we all good, chat? Can you all see me? Can you all hear me? Am I crystal clear? Is everything okay? I think we're good. Yeah? Okay, good. Okay, perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect. All right. I don't know, what do y'all prefer? When I'm zoomed out more or when I'm zoomed in more? What looks better? I can't tell what I like more. I feel like zoomed out you get to see my ears more, but I feel like a little bit zoomed in is kind of nice. Zooming in all the way? Like this? You want me to stream like this? Oh my god. What if... What if I... What if I did this shit again? <laughs> y'all remember that shit? Do y'all remember that shit? When I did this for like an entire cutscene? <laughs> oh my god, that was fucking chaotic. It was so funny. It was so good. Na na na, go back? Maybe. We'll see. Next cutscene, I'll probably do it. All right. Oh, sorry. Did, I, did my neck just do like a 180? What happened there? Okay, Asahi has had his fill of adventure for one day. Well, after that little ordeal, I believe it may be time for us to return to the Enclave. Uh, return, my lord. But what of Namai? You seem so eager to observe the villagers going about their daily lives. To be frank, I still am, but I would... Eh. But I rather doubt the good people of Namai would take kindly to the sight of a man in imperial uniform with blood still dripping from his blade. Even in your company, my presence would only prove a distraction. Fret not, however. Thanks to the three of you, I have had... I have seen a great deal more than I otherwise would. And with any luck, Lord Hien will have finished considering my proposal by the time we return. I don't know. I don't know. It, do it don't seem right. It does not seem right. Okay, so y'all said if I want to TP there, I have to like... <laughs> I have to like... Use something else like this? Uh, 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 what is that? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Teleport menu? Where, what are, where is the teleport menu? Huh? Olive Garden? Why would you go to Olive Garden? On a Friday night? Oh, I was at Olive Garden today and this young girl is like, I want to get the word chaos tattooed on me. The word chaos? Girl. Girl. Well. How young were they? When you say young girl, do you mean like 12? I, sometimes I think about the things that I wanted to get tattooed on me when I was younger, and my god, I'm so glad I didn't get any of them. Some of my tattoos I do want to get removed. I'm not the biggest fan of them anymore. A lot of the time, I would just get tattoos, like, out of impulse. 
you know? Black Friday breadstick deals? Breadstick deals? What does that mean? Wait a second. You guys have, like, unlimited breadsticks at Olive Garden? Is that a joke? Wait. You can also open the map, then, like, tab over to the subzone thing. What the fuck is the subzone thing? Do you think I know if these have, like, icons or not? Or icons. If these have, like, you know, thingies? Titles? What? What? Do I not? No! I... No! I, I don't have... I don't think we have an Olive Garden. And I've never known of a place to give you unlimited breadsticks, but now I kind of want unlimited breadsticks. I'd shit my brains out after, but it would be so worth it. Name the zone on the side there? The name of the... This? The pause menu has teleports. The pause menu has teleports. Th this? Oh my god. This is so... What? Uh. Uh. Oh. <laughs> this is so dumb! This is so dumb! You're telling me I have to do all that? But I couldn't just open my map and TP? Well, well, whatever works, I guess. You could open your- No, I can't! It's not there! See? And it's nowhere here either! Wait. Wait. Wait, was it? Anyway. I'm just gonna pretend that Pepperfawn is not smarter than me. Anyways, thank you again for agreeing to join me. If not for your aid, the Kojin may well have overwhelmed us. Pray go on ahead. Lord Heen is expecting you. I remain without and keep watch over our guest. <laughs> well, we had best not keep him waiting. Sire knew, but Pepper didn't know. Exactly! See? Look, it's all just part of the roleplay, okay? Alright. Oh, hi, Jay! What's up? You are expected, my lady. Shall I show you in? Yee. Let me see, Daddy. I want to see him. I want to see the boy. Show me him. Welcome back, my friend. Yuguri tells me you accompanied her and Asahi on a tour of Yansha. I'd hoped you might take the opportunity to recover from your exertions at Sakazuki, but I gather your time was well spent. Until the ambassador affords Yugiri a chance to make a full report, however, I must rely on you to supply the details. So please, tell us how it all unfolded. <laughs> The Red Kojin, here, have there been any other such incidents since the liberation? Not that I'm aware of. If they are planning some new venture here in Yansha, we will need to increase patrols. In any event, I am indebted to you for fighting them off. But tell me, and don't be modest, was Asahi truly the first to leap to the youngster's aid? He was. I was quite I was quick to doubt him when we first met, but his desire to save them seemed quite genuine. It's possible he truly believes what he's saying. In the time I've known you, you have always been an excellent judge of character. What do you make of the ambassador? Me? He may very well be an honorable man. I still don't think he can be trusted. He's a little twerp. Then the question of what his true intention may be remains. Regardless of his aim, I am I'm resigned to playing his game. For now, at least. 
Well, for swearing, summoning should be simple enough, considering you had never dabbled in it in the first place. Which just leaves the somewhat thornier question of how to police the Red Kojin. It was with that very question in mind that I sought Alfino's counsel. Thanks to his knowledge of the icons and the rituals used to invoke them, I believe we've identified a workable solution. As you will recall, Susano was summoned forth using the power of relics locked away in the Kojin's treasure vault on the Isle of Zeki. Though said relics remain there to this day, it is all but certain that the act of summoning exhausted the their stories, stores of ether, making subsequent summoning impossible. Is that what that said? <sighs> Assuming that is the case, I, preventing the primal's return rests on denying the red code in the means to amass new stores of ether, either via the acquisition of crystals or the relics they are want to collect. For this plan, for this, I plan to enlist the aid of our friends, the Blue Kojin. Since Doma's liberation, we have forged closer bonds with Hunchin and his people. And with their support, I'm quite confident we can keep the Red from obtaining what they require to call upon this Susano. And what of the prisoners? They'll be exchanged as agreed, and I will give full credit to Asahi for the success of the transaction. If there is aught we can do to help the popularis, the popularis, the popularis, garner favor, I mean to see it done. No. Oh. Dramatic music. But first, I have some unfinished business to attend to. Would you all come with me? Yes, of course. But what manner of business? The past mistake which I would see put right, one which has weighed heavy on my mind. Drama! Oh shit. I had her brought here in secret while the three of you kept our guest company. I did say I would do it. What? What? The world has not been kind to you, it is true. But that does not excuse your sins. You should be at the bottom of the river. Amen, King. Yet here you are, the living, breathing proof of my failure. A failure for which I would now make amends. What did I do? I don't remember. Oh, girl. Oh, girl. Was it really so terrible? Tell me, please. What did I do? Oh, honey. Was it terrible? Girl. You speak of sins, my lord. But at whose feet do those sins lie? Whoa. With the soldiers who committed the crimes or those who commanded them to do so? With both, I would say. For all have a conscience, and all must choose. But with no memory of who she is, or what she has done, what sin remains to be cleansed? I agree with you, Gosatsu. You ask that I show mercy. But Hien's hot, so I'm on his side. I ask why the heavens saw fit to deny me my rest. Why, Yotsuyu? was spared not only death, but the bitter memories of her life. Cause she bonked her head, dude! You truly think it the will of the Kami? That's it?! That easily?! Wait, where am I? What about me? If so, her life is not mine to take. It is yours to safeguard. What? Come the hour of the exchange. If her memories have not returned, she may remain here in Doma to live out her days as Tsuyu. But if they, they do, have the guardians shall name? have their vice. They role. couldn't have changed her hair or makeup. The people will protest. They will come to accept my decision when they have been. Everyone's going to recognize her. Thank you, my lord. 
Now then, I believe we have kept our guest waiting long enough. Yeah, I've just been kind of, I've just been kind of chilling here, bro. Oh God, where, where are they? I coming, I coming, I coming. Oh, I coming, I coming, I coming. Did Gorsetsu not seem strange to you? Yeah, something's up. Oh, his sympathy for your Tsuyu apart, I mean. Yeah, it just, it's not so right with me. I know his powers of endurance only too well. But after all he has suffered, even he should not be on his feet. Yeah, I hear you. I, I, I'm with you. He puts you. on a brave face for our sakes. But it would not surprise me if he lacked the strength to raise his blade. Mm-hmm, yeah. Though I suppose if he and Yotsu are to enjoy a life of peace and quiet, he will have little use for it. It falls to us to shape that future. One in which he need never again set foot on the battlefield. Do you want to get married? Is that is are you proposing to me right now? <gasps> oh, oh, oh god, oh god, oh, oh god, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I think he just proposed to me. I think I think that's what that was, right? Right? Alright. <laughs> Yeah, that's, I 100% I think that's what happened there. So now I have another husband. I've got two now. Okay, what's up, Hien? Lord Hien has at last reached a decision. Oh, fuck. With Yotsuyu safely in Gosetsu's care, all that remains to answer Asahi's proposal. I realize our matters, other matters demand your attention, but I would ask that you stay a while longer to see this business through. I mean, you don't really leave me much of a choice. Oh. Coming back, chat. I'm coming back. My apologies. Our deliberations took longer than expected. Think nothing of it. The time afforded me the oh. opportunity to go on a you rather rousing people. excursion through Yansha. His arm is in the way. You have reached a decision then? His arm is in the way. I'm right here. We are willing to cooperate with you in combating the Icon threat and also in the exchange of prisoners. <laughs> Assuming you accept our conditions, of course. <laughs> As you know, your sister is in our care. <laughs> Due to certain complications, however, we are hesitant to release her into your custody. Complications? She was inside Doma Castle when it collapsed. Though she survived, she remembers nothing of her past life, not even her name. To clarify, she is in our care not as a prisoner, but as a vulnerable citizen of Doma. Are you saying you refuse to release her? Yeah, that, that is literally what he said. Not at all. Oh, if never mind. her memory he returns said. before the appointed hour. I lied, don't listen to me. Don't listen to me, little man. And if not, what exactly? You will accommodate her here in Doma? Well, I sincerely doubt she will be of any great strategic value to the Empire. She spends her days daydreaming of Dango. Dango? How dreadful. <laughs> oh. Do you not support her love of sweets? Well? Oh. Very well. In light of our recent misstep in Sakazuki, it seems only fair that I show you the same understanding you have shown us. Though I do have one small request. Regardless of Yotsuyu's value to the Empire, oh, is he gonna kill she her? is yet my sister. No. no. Before I leave, might you permit I me like to speak I like how I'm always just private? jumping to like the most drastic possibilities. Of course. But have I ever been Perhaps wrong? Perhaps you could even bring her a plate of dango. She would be most pleased. 
You, Giddy, will see you to her chambers. Mm. Ooh. Wait, no. <gasps> oh. Pfft. I'm getting a lot of unsettling vibes here. I don't know how I feel about this chat. I don't like this at all. Oh? Black screen? Forgive me, my lord, but has he not been gone over long? Perhaps I should- Calm yourself, Kosetsu. I understand your concern, but we have to wait. He deserves that much. This is kind of weird now that I'm still on my face. <laughs> oh. Oh, I'm over here. Oh, oh, look, they're back. Oh, they brought her. Oh, I'm sorry to have kept you all waiting. Thank you for your understanding. Long did I dream of this reunion, but never did I imagine it would be so joyless. Part of me hoped your stories of her condition were just that. But alas, it is as you say. Suyu, do you remember anything of this man? Anything at all? I... No. I am a stranger to her. That much was clear to me from a single look. I leave her in your care. As you wish. Now, if you will excuse me, my superiors are long overdue report. You'll be elated to hear of our agreement. Of that, I have no doubt. As for the exchange itself, once I have attained the relevant permissions, I will arrange for your people to be relieved of their various duties and sent here to Yansha. This will take time, of course. Of course. You may rest assured your soldiers will be well cared for until your return. We will also begin taking steps to better counter the threat of the Kojin and their icon. Before you take your leave, there is one other matter. I am informed it was you who took the lead in rescuing two young domens from a band of Kojin sellswords. I will not- I have not yet had the time to thank you properly. Please, there's no need to thank me. I only did what anyone would do under the circumstances. Fortunately, I was in good company at the time. The blight of the red Kojin is of the Empire's making. Were it not for our transgressions, those children would not have needed saving. Bye, Hexagon! Take care! And Grits, go to sleep if you're tired. Hi, Nixie! The people of Doma have suffered enough, my lord, and I promise to do all in my power to spare them further pain, be it at the hands of the Kojin or indeed the Empire. I pray the Empire will see things as you do. There may yet be hope for us all. Oh, wait, that's not me. Until we meet again. I don't know. That was that was too clean. This cannot be. Oh. What's up? Oh. Bosetsu. Oh, as before, I leave Yotsuyu to you. Oh. Uh huh. Good stuff. Oh. Okay. Oh, we're looking. We're looking that way now. Oh, they're gone. I invite the rest of you to join me outside. Let's treat Asahi to a proper farewell. Mm-hmm. Oh, 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 are we going? Oh! All right. <laughs> I don't know what it is about doing this that is so fun for me, but I love it. <laughs> when I first did it during, what was it? Uh, was it Heaven's Word or A Realm's Reborn? A Realm's Reborn? A Realm Reborn. One of them. It was- it was so good. I was like, blimey! <laughs> I need to make like a little TikTok of it. I have it saved somewhere. Alright, speak with Hien. I- like, I refuse to believe that the patch is just gonna end like this. Oh, hello? Hello? The ambassador's airship awaits at Castrum Fluminus. Let us be off. All right. Oh. Do I do the rest of this patch like that? I wish you We're a safe journey. It. We're doing it. We're doing it, chat. This has been a most enjoyable visit. I look forward to our next meeting. I don't. Maxima, 
Would you take the others and see that all is ready for our departure? I simply cannot leave without first giving thanks to the Warrior of Light for accompanying me through Yansha. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh! Oh! Oh, God. That's the back of my head. It's looking kind of ridiculous. Ah! Mark me, savior ah! of the savages. Ooh! There will be a reckoning. You got the same eyes as your sister. <gasps> I gasp. Oh, no. oh, oh! Oh my god. Oh shit. You've nowhere left to run, traitor. Is this him? Oh yeah. Ignorant savages. Killing us will avail you not. For every imperial you cut down, a thousand more will come. Abandon this foolish endeavor and surrender. You may yet serve our righteous cause. Uh uh. How dare you speak of righteousness? You who forsook kith and kin to serve conquerors. Be glad I grant you this mercy. Hello? Huh. What in the... <gasps> Wait. That's not Ashley Tisdale. That's Ashley Tisdale's... No, that is Ashley Tisdale! It's Ashley Tisdale! Reinforcement? No, just one! Cut him down! Mm. He's gonna flick his little hand and you're dead. Oh, good God. Oi! 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 <laughs> In the air! Damn, that easy, huh? And he j and he just drops it? And he just walks away he's got musicals to perform i guess oh new blade it's pretty thank you thank you sir friendship and gunbreaker ended samurai is my this new best friend this one is <laughs> promising Who remains to offer us no, resistance? It's Final Fantasy. You can just change your class whenever you want, you know? If it applies to me, it applies to them. Uh, a host of rebels led by Lord Cayenne hold the Enclave across the river. Lord Cayenne. The king of the... The former king now, of Jeff. Dorma, sir. They say he is one of the greatest swordsmen alive. Is that what they say? Apparently. Who was that? Surely you jest. That was Zenos Yegalvas, Legatus of the Twelfth, the Crown Bloody Prince. I heard he was strong, but that. that was frightening. That was Lord Zenos. 
That twinkle in his eye. <laughs> oh. Oh. Everything you Oh, I are, I don't like that. Your power. Even your face. It vexes me. Bro, look in the mirror. I feel the same way, honey bunny. Oh, angry face. Oh. Go on. Lash out like the beast you are. What the fuck? At an emissary. And jeopardize the newfound peace between Dorma and the Empire. He said I'm ugly. My lord was destined to lead us onto a glorious new age. Mm -mm. Your light is nothing to his radiance. Girl, I will bite your ass. I will, I will act, I will bite you. I will bite. I will, am I, am I going to tell them what I heard? I Can they not hear this? this Can they not hear me Look or hear him? Until the day we meet again. Look, I'm not one for killing kids. Oh, f God damn it! But I will skewer him. Oh, well. Oh, he's 26? Then I'm chilling. Just, just watching it sail off. Oh, I'm gone. Xenos was 26? Xenos was a year older than me? No shot. No fucking shot. Xenos was just a year older than me. Xenos and a Manolene are the same age? Bro, they both need therapists, man. That kid really looked at my beautiful face and said, Your face fixes me. Like, what the? This game is quite good at making characters look hideous. All of their, like, Hoo -ha -ha! faces are just atrocious. Oh, it's another cutscene. Is it voiced? Or am I telling them? You look troubled, my friend. Was it something he said? Of all the memories to witness, no, no. I had my doubts about him, but I would never have guessed he was a disciple of Xenos. Really, Yugiri? My lord. Calm yourself, Yugiri. I set no store by him or his enlightened brethren. But if by treating with them there is even the faintest hope we might secure the return of our conscripted brothers and sisters, I must play this game. After the way I risked their lives in the rebellion, I owe them that much. Oh, I love him. He's so sexy. That's so sexy My lord, of you. You bear no blame for their fate. If not blame, then responsibility. They were prisoners, and still I chose to fight, knowing they could be executed in retaliation. Oh, he's so sexy. This is so but sexy. But now we him. have a chance to bring them home. If it means bargaining with a monster, so be it. My lord. I love them both. I love you, Giri. Besides, I, I love think he uncle. likes me. Which is more than some can say. Hey, yo? What the fuck? Bro, I know you're right, but you don't gotta say it. Not to my face. Man's got jokes! <laughs> the fuck? I think my favorite part of catching you Final Fantasy 14 streamers is seeing who they sip for. 
Well, I'm missing dialogue, but, um... Ta-da! Perhaps he no longer thought it necessary, having secured Doma's corporation in the prisoner exchange. If he truly is a disciple of Xenos, tis possible emotion simply got the better of him. Remaining calm around the woman who slew his lord will have taken its toll. That's fair. But you didn't have to call me ugly. That was kind of mean. Whatever the explanation, now is not the time for hasty reprisals. Brew King. We shall proceed as planned. The Red Cogent must be placed under surveillance and the Garlean prisoners made ready for the exchange. But you need not concern yourself with the details. Go on. Proceed. Leave the affairs of Doma to us. When the hour of the exchange draws near, we will call for you. I should certainly hope so. Whatever the Empire's true intent, we would be on hand to play our part, either to defend Doma or to help usher in a lasting peace. I had thought we might use this time to return to Eorzea, but given the uh, volatility of the situation, mayhap it be best if we remained in Kugane. Agreed. Between your- Oh, I forgot the accent. Uh, agreed. Between Yotsuyu's amnesia and Asahi's dubious agenda, then we have ample reason to remain in the neighborhood. If anything should happen, anything at all, you must send for us at once. Oh, I will. On that, you have my word. Charting a path through this sea of troubles promises to be difficult enough. I'm not so proud as to attempt the feat alone. To Kugane, then. Tataru and the others must know of what transpired here. Oh. Oh, give me a second. Ooh. Oh, I'm cramping all of a sudden. I mean, I've been cramping this whole time, but this one's like... Do you all ever drink water or just like anything really quickly and then it just doesn't settle right? That's what's happening to me right now. I chugged my water. I'm talking about how my water didn't settle right and Jin, you're fucking redeeming hydration? Yeah, tell me get so wishy-washy. Yeah, that's one way to put it. Ray, are you fucking kidding? Wow. Thank you. Oh, you're so kind. Oh, you're so sweet. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. I get a pit in my throat too when that happens. Ooh, yeah, same sometimes. Oh. Oh, I think I have to poop. All right, chat, I'll be right back. This seems like a good pausing point. Okay, so speak with Hancock at the Ruby Bazaar in Kugane. All right, we'll finish this objective once I come back from my poop.
Chat? I've returned. What the fuck? Chat? What? Hello? Y'all, I'm gonna be such a fucking pisser. All right. OMG, yes, I believe. Ooh, ooh no, wait. Huh? Okay, uh, so I'm glad that y'all have faith in me. Wait, hold on. That changed drastically. That went from 100 to 0 to 55 to... F what the fuck? Hey, yo? Chat? No one's got faith in me? Oh, my. Chat really said, go piss girl. All right, I'm feeling, I'm feeling a little bit better now. Okay. Ooh, what if I pin some of my hair back? What if I, what if I pin some of it back? I, okay, I am not surprised that that little twerp had ulterior motives. I, I am not surprised in the slightest. I'm excited to see this. Bio! Bio, thank you for the 10 gifted subs. Quake, thank you for the one gifty! <gasps> Cute. Thank you so much! Welcome everybody to the Covenant of your Badger Emotes and your stay. Wow, chat really is against me. Asahi is the literal worst. I literally want to skewer him. And not in the way that I want to be skewered by Orshifa. I want him on the edge of my sword. And then, like, pushed slowly through the rest of it. Hold on. I fucked it up. You see that? I could say the same about me or about the kid. I've never hated anyone as much as I hate Asahi. Honestly, at this point, I think he is also my most hated character. And then there's Lise. Can you see how many hydration redeems that was? No. I could count, but I won't. Okay, now who's a rich bitch who just pumped all their CPs into believers, huh? Who did that? Oh! Oh, look at that! It's now 6733! Wow! Okay. Some of y'all got more faith in me? Appreciate it. It depends on who we're talking about and whose sword. Look, touche. Well, we were talking about Asahi, not Asaira. Lise? Yeah, I'm not I'm not Lise's biggest fan. I uh, I hate to admit it, but there's a chance that I I don't like Lise. Where the ass am I going? Okugane, right? Yeah. Lise definitely has grown on me. Ida and Thankard are both meat socks. What the fuck is a meat sock? Actually, do I want to know what a meat sock is? What is happening? Who just poured so many points into the into the believers? Jesus. A sock filled with meat? Like a cum sock? Do you- are you jerking off to them? I wish I was a meat sock that someone would fill me. Honestly, relatable. Very relatable. I mean, what? Me? Down bad? No. Hi, husband. Greetings, honored madame. Will you be entering the Ruby Bazaar offices? Enter. My, it seems you're all quite in- you're all in quite the predicament. Well, should we receive any urgent missives from Doma, rest assured you will be the first to know of it. Yes, of course. We're discussing ideas to replenish our coffers, but I suppose that all can wait if any urgent news should come through the office. Ah, uh, ahem, about that. I wish to apologize, Sataru. It was reckless of me to make such a purchase without first consulting you. You may be certain, however, that I mean to reimburse the Scions, even if it means drawing upon my personal funds. 
That's very thoughtful of you, but I'm sure it won't come to that. If Sarban's business proposition is as promising as it sounds, Pepper should have no difficulty wiping the red from our ledger. Alright, girl, come on. I mean, I do have Sarnix, so I guess you're kind of right. Like, I'm not going to use the Kojin funds. I'll use Sarnix, so he's got you. Forgive me, Pepper. It would seem I've unwittingly heaped my financial troubles upon you. I swear I'll pay you back. Though I fear I will struggle to cobble together anything of monetary value. Knowledge I can gather in abundance. To start, I plan to investigate the divisions forming within the Empire. Ah, mayhap Riol and his associates have heard something on the subject. Regardless, the more we know about the politics of Garlemald, the better our chances of predicting the Imperial's next move, which might yield you an advantage on the day of the prisoner exchange. Knowing what we do of Asahi's apparent resentment towards you, I cannot say he ho what he hopes to gain from it. But if there is even the faintest chance that a lasting peace could be forged between Doma and the Empire, what choice have we but to try? Lord Hien had the right of it. Asahi may very well be a monster, but we must play his game. For now. Sorry, there's one of chat. His name is Salomane 4 x 4 x He's got banned. What happens? Did he do something wrong? Hmm. Do you have two accounts, my guy? Or is this your buddy? Look, I'm you know what? I'm gonna I'm just going to I didn't want to do this, but I will do this. Don't ever go into a streamer's chat and demand their attention. Especially when they're in the middle of a game and also talking to other people. If a message of yours gets missed, it's gone in the ether. Sure, you can try saying it again, but if it gets missed again, it's gone. Get over it. Move on. Especially if it's something that isn't fucking important. If you come into my chat and ask me ten times, where's your dog? Is he asleep? While I'm ranting about something and like chat's going boom, 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 boom. Don't come back and ask me a hundred fucking times if my dog is asleep! Sire, check my message. Sire, check my message. Sire, check my message. Sire, I redeemed something. Can you do it, Sire? Are you gonna do it, Sire? Blah, blah, blah. I am not a Tamagotchi. Alright? Streamers are not your Tamagotchi to control at your will. Just because you can type to us and get a live response and just because you can redeem points and maybe I'll do something does not mean I have to. Thank you. And sending me bits is not going to make it any better. This goes for everybody. Don't do that to streamers ever. I will rip you apart. I will take your little butthole with my pliers and go pew! And I will shove some dynamite in there. And I won't light it. But it'll be there. Streamer, please pay attention to me right now. Streamer, please check your DM. Streamer, please. Streamer, please. Streamer, please. Streamer, by the way, can you pay attention to me? Streamer, please. What's up? What about me? Oh, streamer, please. I donated $1. Streamer, please. I donated one dollar, which means you only get 67 cents because Twitch takes all of your money, streamer, please! <sighs> so, if you get banned, it's for a reason. I would like to assume... No. I would, I would like to think that my mods and I are pretty lenient when it comes to banning. Um, we give people a lot of chances, um, a lot of benefits of the doubt being thrown around. So if you get banned... Ban me? I don't know what I walked into. Mods! Ban them. Those dollar at streamer, streamer, do what I want. Streamer, please. Streamer, please. Peace. Streamer, can you please drink that water? Streamer, can you please touch your elbows? Can you stand up and turn around, please? Hey, streamer, you dropped something. Pick it up. <laughs> it's so it's it's so frustrating. And you know what the you know what the funny part is too. You know, chat sees your messages too, right? Th these aren't private DMs, 
So not only am I ignoring you, but chat's ignoring you too. <laughs> Don't be that person. Don't be that person. <laughs> thirst knows thirst knows no limitation. No, you're right, you're right. Oh, anyways. Hi friends, hello. There's a lot of first time chatters all of a sudden. Can we get a hi? Oh my god, can I control my chat? Chat, here's the dollar. Do what I fucking say. <laughs> Alright. Look at my eyelashes. Look how pointy they look. They look so cute. Alright. <laughs> Alright, you ready to get back to the game? I am. Okay, what do we have here? Let's see. Armor offending maiming. Maiming! Maiming! I need that for a dragoon, right? Winged island at one point, thank you. That rant was refreshing. Well, you feel cleansed? Good. Good, I'm glad I could be of assistance. Oh, 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 what's going on here? What's going on here? Arranging the prisoner exchange proved easier than I thought. Oh. Alright, let's see what his true intentions are. Yes, my lord will be most pleased. Everything is going according to plan. Oh, fuck! Okay, look, it's not like we didn't see that coming. Why am I acting surprised? I called it the second I saw him. Can you truly remember nothing? Nothing at all? Were we... friends? Yes! We were good friends, you and I. In fact, I've brought you a gift. I pray that one day soon, as you gaze into that mirror, you will remember the woman staring back at you. Okay, that's actually sweet. That's, that's actually sweet. Hate the kid. It's so pretty. Who are you? Who are you? I want to feel bad, but I just can't. I just can't. I really cannot. Mafia, thank you so much for the sub. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Alright, meanwhile in the Imperial Castle? Is that what they said? Imperial something something. Who the hell is this? How are you feeling, my lord? Oh. Fine, now leave me. Ashley Tisdale! Kid, no. 
Does the little kid know? Oh, he's gonna have a fucking raging boner when he finds out. Thank you for the 10 gifted subs, dentist. I appreciate it. Oh, look, thank you for the 23 months. Are looking absolutely beautiful, you wonderful weirdo. Ha. Blue heart. A look said, a looking. It was funny hearing that in my headset after saying your name. Thank you for the 23 months. I appreciate it. We're almost at two years. Holy fuck, I knew it. I fucking knew it. I told you. Chat, I told you. I could have. I, I, I swear to God, I wrote this game. I wrote this game. Me. Me. This, 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 I did this. Okay. All right. Sorry, I got really excited and started choking on my spit. We're good, though. We're good. Alfino has important news to share. Am I still in patch 4.2? Ah, Pepper. Impeccable timing. We have just received a letter from Lord Hien. He writes that the domains are coordinating their efforts with Blue Cogent to maintain a constant watch over the red. By stating on the- By staying! Sorry, on the lookout of signs of crystal hoarding and the like, they mean to nip any summoning attempts in the bud, thereby satisfying the conditions for peace set down by the ambassador. For the Garlean's part, the Popularis have sent word that a vessel bearing the domain conscript is soon to arrive in Yansha, which would seem the prisoner exchanges to proceed as planned. Lord Hien requests your presence. And I share his view that you should be on hand at this cr cr critical juncture. <laughs> According to the letter, Yotsuya's memory has yet to return, so it looks like she'll be living out the rest of her days in Doma, assuming the ambassador means to honor the agreement, of course. Before we get to that, however, I think it would be wise to assess him. Condition one last time. Oh, my crap. He's oh, I'm at 4.3! Uh, could you want to the domains have missed any change in her mental state, however slight it would be better if Asahi weren't the one to spot it. Agreed. Let us make straight ways for the Enclave then. Lord Hien will be. I missed it. LSR, thank you for the prime sub. I trust you will co. Don't worry about me, I'll be fine. Just be sure to come back safely. LSR? Like Aragorn? Oh man. I feel good. I feel good. I feel so good right now. Alright, let me zoom in just a smidge. There. Oh my god. Okay, where am I going? Oh, I remember the hack. Wait. Hold on. Wait. Okay, all third. Okay. Okay. Now let me see. Look, it's not there! It's literally not there! It's not there! This game is gaslighting me. I literally have to go to teleport just to get there. Wait, where is it? It's literally not there unless I go... Into the teleport menu. Oh my god. I got that post boom boom glow. <laughs> I do. I do. Y'all are still there? Okay. Lord Hien is expecting you. May I show you in? The plot thickens. Ah, I see my letter reached you across the Ruby Sea. Thank you for coming so swiftly. Though I wrote at some length on the subject of the forthcoming exchange, there is one other matter I neglected to mention. It concerns Gosatsu. As you may have observed, he returned from his ordeal rather the worse for wear, and despite his best efforts to conceal his condition, or perhaps because of them, he recently collapsed! Good gods, is he alright? Confined to bed and grumbling without seas, but he has shown signs of recovery. He made me promise to tell you, lest you worry unduly, which was all very well will when you weren't here. Now that you are, however, I think it high time he received some visitors. Might you spare him a moment? Yotsuyu has scarce left his side, and I imagine you are curious to see what has become of her as well. We'll visit him at once. Pepper, Alize, shall we? I don't trust this. 
I really don't trust this. Open wide now. Please to you. I'm not so frail that I cannot feed myself. Uh-huh. You were about to accept it, though. <sighs> I grow weary of the taste of gruel. He got caught. You don't like it? Can I fetch you something else? Hi, wine. Or if that is not wholesome enough, I don't know. A sweet persimmon from Namai? I enjoyed them in my youth. A persimmon. Nay, pay me no mind. I am full. Besides, Did that just we have guests. something in her head? I hope we are not interrupting your meal. We had heard you were confined to bed and thought you might welcome some visitors. Confined to... A gross exaggeration. He's so stubborn, I love him. A trifle drained from my exertions, perhaps. But with a little rest, I shall be fighting fit again in no time. Take off your clothes. Gusetsu, is this how you've been spending your time? My lady, I assure you, this is not... Off with them! We need to wash you, you stink! <laughs> he do be stinky. But... Oh, right, right here? What are all these scars? There are so many of them. Wait, this is kind of hot. No. No. A life of battle will leave its mark upon a man. Why am I into this? Oh shit. Oh fuck! Is something wrong to you? It's nothing. I'm fine. But leave me be, woman. I will not be fussed over like some newborn babe. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't be laughing if I were y'all. They make a convincing pair, do they not? On first acquaintance, I would think him a doting grandsire and her a model grandchild. I mean, um, I don't think that's the, um, combination I would go for, but sure. Indeed, had someone told me a year ago that I would live to bear witness to such a scene, I would have declared them mad. But aside, I'm relieved to see Gosetsu has lost none of his spirit. But what a turn of events. I mean, for her to suddenly be watching over him. He couldn't make it up, although I suppose Gosetsu is an old man. With the way he charges through life, it can be easy to forget. Aye, he has resisted decrepitude with the same defiance he showed the enemies of Doma. But no matter how adamant his will, no man can carry on forever. He has pushed himself beyond the limits of endurance too many times. Even if his health returns, the fact remains, he will never again be the warrior he once was. He has given his all for legion, legion land. And we will ask no more. And what of his nurse? If Yotsuyu is feigning that, well, she certainly has me fooled. This is no pretense? Yugiri, out of all of us, I would think you the hardest to convince. So, what makes you so sure? I have been spying on Yotsuyu from the shadows, waiting for the misstep that would betray her charade for what it is, or what it was. But her mask has never slipped, not once. She's remained in character from the first. One evening, I watched her as she sat in her chambers, unguarded and alone. <clears throat> she 
she had taken the dishes from the cupboard, the cupboard, and was preparing to prepare dinner right there on the tatami, a child's game. Even the rarest shinobi would not go to such lengths. I can but conclude that her mind is truly broken. <laughs> Yo, relatable though? Well, that's good enough for me, and everyone else, I would hazard. Alright, the matter is settled. Yotsuyu will become Suyu, and begin a new life here in Doma. Before that can happen, however, we will need to present her to the ambassador one last time to prove that her memory is truly gone. I would not risk parading her in front of our returning conscripts. Her presence at the exchange would only stir up mutinous thoughts. Understandably, she as good as fastened the chains around their neck. Aye, which is why I mean to conclude this business with Suyu first, out of the sight of my countrymen. Will you help me? We are at your service. There's no higher purpose in the pursuit of peace. My thanks. The Garleans are on their way. Oh, fudge. And we must prepare to welcome the ambassador. We will meet you at the docks with Suyu. Oh, The anxiety? <sighs> Hi, Paris. Stream is going good. What were the Voros twins like? Big fan of theirs? They're great. Are those Muppets even real? They're great. No, they're wonderful. They're not as dumb as you'd think. It's obviously just like their whole gimmick. They're wonderful. Carnage, thank you for the raid. Hello. Hello, friends. My name is Syra. I am a Final Fantasy streamer, and we are getting through these Stormblood patches. We're on 4.3, and I need to take an Advil. I hope you had a good stream, Carnage. What'd you get up to? I'm gonna turn off my light chat. I hope that's okay. Ooh. Ooh, chat, give me one second. I gotta, I gotta cramp a little bit. Yeah, the twins are genuinely such nice people, and their videos are so ridiculous, and they're, they're just, they're great. Thank you. I was just saying that, yes, um, they're very wholesome. Their comedy is super jokes, and I too would die for them. And I also said, Pars, I thought you said I gotta piss. And I was gonna say, go piss, girl. Enjoy your PS5. Are you gonna be playing God of War? I'm assuming that's why you got it. Now I'm gonna chill a bit on here and play Pokemon as I lay in bed and watch stream as well, because Lord, Black Friday was paying 11 hours standing. Fuck, I can only imagine. Honestly, kudos to anybody that had to work today. Seriously. I don't know how y'all do it. Shout out to the Black Friday workers. Okay. Wait, I'm already here. Speak with Alfino. You know. Is he outside? Or, I guess so. Yeah, 11 hours? That's nuts. What time did you start? Okay. 
Okay, where am I going? Okay, to the docks. Oh yes, to the docks, right. Right, because we're gonna we're gonna bring Suyu to the Imperials because the Garleans are on their way. Something, something, something. Right? Piss girl? I said what I said, I said go piss girl. Shall we wait here then? Lord Hien should not be long. <laughs> not Pepperfont enabling the cussing the second I do too. My friends, have you seen Suyu? She is nowhere to be found. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. What? But the garlands will be landing in a matter of moments. If she's fled, could it mean her memories have returned? Oh my god. I know not. Yugiri is scouring the streets as we speak, but it is possible Suyu has left the enclave altogether. Oh my god. Is, where's Gosetsu, though? Is he still in bed? Captain, a word. Do you perchance carry a fair skinned woman across the river? Fair skin a fair skinned woman, my lord? I, I do not rightly know. I think. Yes! Yes, my lord, now that you mention it, there was a lady among the passengers whom I do not recall having seen before. Her face was hidden by the brim of her hat, but I remember taking her hand to help her onto the boat. White as new fallen snow it was. Was she someone important, my lord? Have I done something wrong? Wrong? No, no. I was merely hoping to catch our guest before she departed. Be at ease, captain. Oh, Hien, you are such a good boy. You are such a good boy. But seeing that Suyu has crossed the river, Kami, help me. No good can come of this. Fuck! I can only assume that her memories have returned. Something, something bad is coming. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. I need to- I want to know if Gosetsu's okay, if he's still in bed. If he dies for this woman again, I swear to god. Fuck. It seems Suyu has gone unrecognized thus far, but Kami help us if someone catches a clear view of her face. I must find her before that happens. The responsibility for her disappearance, for all of this, lies with me. I would ask for your aid nonetheless. We are at your service, Lord Hien, now as before. Let us make the crossing and begin our search. You go on ahead. Someone should let you, Gary, know what we've learned. I'll join you on the other side. Sounds good, Bean. We have no way of knowing where Suyu is headed, so we had best divide our forces. I will take Kusakari and its surrounds. Alfino, if you would take the road to Castrum Fluminus? Pepper, forgive me, but could I ask you to interrogate the residents of, Yus of Yuzuka Manor? One of the Namazu may well have seen our quarry. Carnage, thank you for the gifted sub. I appreciate it. If everyone is in agreement, let us board the skiff and hope the commies smile upon our efforts. It's time to get back on this DA grind. Enjoy Dragon Age. You work from 4.45 a.m. until 2 p.m.? Holy shit, Carnage. These patches are when Ishikawa stepped up into the writing role, correct? I have no clue, actually. Chat, can you answer that? I'm, ass I'm assuming chat has the answer for that. I am going to quickly grab some Sprite because I need something fizzy in my in my stomach. Um, I'm, I'm not, like, I'm comfortable enough to keep streaming, but I'm not feeling my sharpest. Um. So, like, give me one second, chat. I just need, I need something for this, these crampies.
Hi, Tarek. Hello. Ooh. Thanks, friends. Okay, so, but is she, is she, that's Ishikawa, I think that's the name, right? That's the person who wrote the Dark Knight quest line? If I remember correctly, she has another writer. Oh, she had another writer, I don't know, of Rose Stormblood. She handled the Doma story. He handled Alamigo story. And they, collaborate, they collaborate to combine them together. Oh. It was 3.2 and 3.4 and then 4.0. Oh. Ah. Aha. Aha. So I have to blame her for some of my misery. Not all of it. But some of it. I see, I see. God, the Dark Knight quest stuff fucked me so good. Fucked me raw. <laughs> also, she wrote Orshvon's part of a realm reborn. Interesting to me. Oh, my boy. It's really, it's so embarrassing that, like, I can't look or, like, think of Orshifon without, like, freaking out and just going, my boy. And Moon Brita, my girl! <laughs> Chat, stop. She wrote Coils and the Crystal Tower. The Crystal Tower. Wasn't, like, the Crystal Tower the Grahatia thing? And the coils are the coils of Bahamut, right? <sighs> I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. All right, cool. So I should be prepping my tissues? For tears, correct? Lots of crying coming up? I hope not. I hope not. I promised myself I wouldn't cry anymore. She also the screenplay for the original flip for movie starring Elijah Wood and Jonathan Banks. <laughs> wow, she's so versatile! Well, I mean, isn't this what you wanted for Christmas? To get fucked? No, that's what I wanted for Halloween. For Christmas, I just want to be loved. Look! It's a little bagoogie! Oh, I fucking love these guys. Listen to them! They squeak! Husband! Welcome to Yuzuku, Yuzuka Manor. Yes, yes. If there is anything you care to know, you need only, hmm? A pale-skinned woman? I have seen no such traveler. I am so sorry to say. Most sorry. Scaly skin Namazu, on the other hand. We have an abundance. <laughs> Where's the next one? I saw Pepperfong go in here, but then he ran out. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? He dreaming! Thank you for gifting Nixie a sub. Nixie, welcome to Covenant with your badger months and your stay. Look at him! Unusually pale skin. Yes, yes. I saw this woman on the way back from my fishing trip. She had just crossed the shallows east of here and was headed in a northeasterly direction for the most part. Her steps do not seem certain. If you hurry, you might still catch her. I fucking love these little guys. Put him in some water. He needs some milk. He needs, he needs some milk. <laughs> He'll be going to rigor mortis. Leave him alone. He was having a dream and he was squeaking. He was doing a little squeak. I love this little cute, this cute little uh, witch hat badge. It's fucking cute, right? Yeah. I love my badgies. Oh, ether Korean. The little dude is having a stroke. The little guy's fine. Yeah, he's just having a little dream. Do I have a minion? 
Okay, I have not not had Orchifon since I got him. But do I have a little squeaker? I feel like I do. Oh, I do. Does it squeak when it walks? Can I just pretend that's Pepper? Can I just pretend that's how Pepper sounds when she's walking? God, minions in this game are too fucking cute, man. Alright, come back, little man. Oi. I'm so glad I don't have an Uber. Do it squeak when I walk it. Do a little squeak, squeak. It go. <laughs> it's too cute. Those catfish are super cute. Honestly, if I wasn't so glued. Do you need an Uber? No, I'm just being a little brat. If it like if it wasn't if it wasn't for me having the Orshifon minion, I would probably have that one as my minion. Quick, 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 quick. The one I was gonna be a cat boy, then I changed my bun boy, and yeah, I've been getting stopped in game for the way I look. Wait, so are you a bun boy or a cap? Oh yeah, you are a bun boy. I don't really get stopped often, but every so often someone will kiss me, unprovoked. <laughs> Just unlock the ether currents to be your own Uber. No! As soon as I get the frog in a wizard hat, oh the the what is it called? The porog? The porogrog? Those things are fucking cute too. You see no son of y'all see you to the north. Perhaps she is somewhere Farther off to the northeast. All right, show off. Uber, we are going to 1633. If the ether currents wanted Pepper's attention, they should have been much more convenient and they should have been sexier. But no. But no. I used to get stopped off and now I just hang out at my house so no one can stop me. Sorry, next, why would you do that? Do you not want attention? I want attention. I want people to stop me. But I'm just a cute little bean. Instead, I stop other people. <laughs> Still no sign of Yatsuyu. Perhaps she is yet farther to the northeast. Well. Go forth, Uber. Oh wait, I could have walked there. Too bad. Uber? This that way. Good, good Uber. Oh, nope. Uh, there you go. Oh, and eh, thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Uber. Damn, I'm surveying for a long ass fucking time. I thought that was Jin saying they're trying to eat me. I saw the blue and thought, girl. The old CEO is nowhere to be seen, but lying on the ground a short distance to the north, she spot from there looking wide brimmed hat. <gasps> is it her hat? I see somebody there. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Vosk. You good? You good, buddy? A cursory glance is all that is required to confirm your suspicions. It is the same hat Yotsuyu was wearing when you found her in Sakazuki. Oh, fuck. What on earth is ERP? Oh, honey. Don't go down that route. Pepper! Before you ask, our search of Kusakarius and its surroundings has yielded exactly not. Save this chance reunion with you, I suppose. 
Mistress Alize has gone to assist her brother at the castrum. It was she who informed me to this, of the situation. I joined Lord Hien here shortly after. How did you fare at Yuzuka Manor? Any sign of our missing guest? Mm-hmm. Towards Namai! But the Kami! If the villagers recognize her, it will not end well. We must hurry. Yugiri and I will check the patties. The village square is yours. Extreme raid progression. Extreme raid progression. <laughs> Chat. Oh. <gasps> oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Greetings. Might I have one of your Wait! Please! Oh. I only wanted a persimmon. Oh, Kami, save us! Her spirit has returned! She's back from the dead to seek her revenge! It can't be. She couldn't have survived. Oh, fuck. What did I... What did I do? As if you don't know. Oh, no. Good people of Namai, be at ease, I pray you. You have naught to fear. This is not gonna go well. My lord, forgive me, but what is that monster doing here? They told us she was dead. I too was surprised to learn of her survival. More Maybe even this than you is not the happen. time for me to meme with a I who cut dramatic her down, zoom in. I who left her to her fate. But I will stay here. But it would seem the Kami had other plans. By some miracle, both she and Gosetsu were spared when the keep collapsed, though Yotsugu's preservation came at the cost of her memory. You're saying she's forgotten? Forgotten everything she's done? Lies! Lies! My lord, she would say anything to escape punishment! Oh. What does it matter? We have not forgotten her crimes! And we demand Aww. justice! I beg of you, Lord Hien, draw your blade and rid us of this canker! Oh. What I saw then, it's all true. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. Is he gonna kick her? You're sorry. And what? We're supposed to forgive you. Oh shit. She's gonna forgive her? And then they're all gonna be like, oh. Here, there's no need to cry. Hey, yo? Just giving her the per oh there you go can't you see how scared she is how can you be scared of her she's not the same oh Until such time as her memories return, 
This woman shall be known as Tsuyu and treated as a citizen of Doma. I will, however, see that she is watched at all times. Rest assured that there will be no more unannounced visits to the village. As your lord, I ask that you leave her fate in my hands and suffer her to live for now. This is... Please, Issei. Man! All right. I'll keep my peace. I'm still not pro Yatsuyu. As long as you're happy, that's all that matters. I can't forgive her. I can't do it. Oh, Hey, I want head pots! What the fuck? Where are mine? Where are mine? Uh... Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, chat. Get your short king to provide head pass. I don't have a short king. I don't have anybody. I'm my own short king. Oh my god. Excuse me? Excuse me, Jin, where are my head pads? Only clown face? Oh. Let's be honest, that's why chat's really here. Head pads for Syra? True. Mm hmm. I got my cramps. Ugh. Excuse me, Orshima is tall, not small? Exactly. I have a tall king. These cramps are vile. Surely you can buy a short king? <laughs> you right? Do you think Suyu is faking amnesia? I don't think she's faking it. I just don't think it's going to end well. And whether or like it's I guess it's like a tough a tough subject because like Yes, she has no memory of who she was, like, you, sh you, can't, you shouldn't, I don't know, throw that trauma onto her. But that doesn't mean people are able to forgive her or forget, you know? How long is 4.3? Because now I have 4.3, 4.4, 4.5. Yen's face is a picture of relief. Relief? That would have been better avoided, but at least it did not end in bloodshed. And judging by Sue's reaction, she remains oblivious to the events of her former life. This was no escape attempt. Nay, it seems it was an offhand request for Gosetsu's... A request of Gosetsu's which brought her to Namai. She came in search of a, per a persimmon. Ha! And they say fruit is good for the health. I do hope Gosetsu finds a taste to his liking. Well, we have certainly taken the long way around, but let us continue on to Castrum Fluminus and our meeting with the ambassador. Alfino and Alize should still be there, conducting their search. Oh, fuck. Mm, I wonder who that was. Hmm. All right. Okay. Okay, where am I going? I'm going this way. Oh! <gasps> Wait! I'm getting my head pads! Wait! I want more! 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 Give me. Yeah. 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 I get. I get. I get my head pads. I'm getting my head pads. I'm getting all my pads. Yee! 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 They give me the pads. Yeah! Yeah! Pat, 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 pat. Sarnix, stop showing off. All right. Now, I must go back on my journey. Okay, how far do I have to go, though? All the way down there? Okay, that's not too bad, actually. I'll take my chocobo. And I'll go, I'll just like quickly go unlock these areas too, because that's going to bother me on the map. I'm 5'5", five five, but 5'9 in my heart. 
I feel like, okay, I'm 5'2", but I feel like because of what I've heard from people on the internet, I have tall energy. map saying Jin. Does I have tall energy? Apparently I do. I've been told that... Oh, I already got it. I've been told that I do. There's no way you aren't at least 5'7". OMG, you tiny baby. I small, yeah. I'm just a babby. I'm just a babby. Oh, wait. 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 I want my Uber. Wait, where's my... Where's my Uber? Where's my... Uber! Mm. 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 Brat energy too? Stop. Uh, I have big dork energy? True, I do have dork energy. Is this when you post pictures or when you stream? Oh, my tall energy? It's apparently only in my photos. When I'm streaming, I think it's just brat energy. I think that's all it is. Nope. Take a few head pats from a 5 foot 4 short king. Thank you! Thank you for the $50 donation! Holy fuck! Dentist, thank you so much. I will take all the head. You're five four? Oh my god, my short king has been found. All right. It seems our imperial guests have already arrived. It's time to meet with the ambassador. <gasps> thank you for the. I got more head pat. Oh shit, oh fuck, oh no. I'm scared. <laughs> what a pleasure it is to see you once more, Lord Hien. Not to mention my dear sister. A pleasure to see you too, Ambassador. Forgive us our late arrival. You have our people aboard the airship? Exactly as agreed. We would leave you in no doubt as to the purity of our intentions. I dare say it was the self-same spirit of cooperation which prompted you to bring Yotsuyu here today. Indeed. Before excluding her from the exchange, I thought it only fair that you see her condition for yourself. Physically, she is in fine health, but her mind is unchanged. So I see. But all need not necessarily be lost. In anticipation of this tragic turn of events, I took the liberty of inviting some special guests. Is it Ashley Tisdale? Oh. Ooh. Ah, Yatsuyu. Okay. You look well. Is that her parents? Or the two that mistreated her? Like, the yeah! <gasps> of all the people. Is
is what something the drama? wrong, dear sister? These are our beloved parents. Does not the sight of them bring back sweet childhood memories? I'm gonna beat this kid up with my fucking yoke. I have to take this to Gosets. <laughs> it would seem my little surprise was not sufficient. You little cunt. You needn't glare at me so, Lord Hien. I merely did what any loving son would do for his family. Lest you doubt, I am content to leave the acting viceroy in your care. Pray, treat her as you would any daughter of Dorma. Can he look at me that way? Do not grow too fond of this place, dear sister. You will come back to us ere long. I hate this kid. I hate this kid. Whoop his ass. Beat him with a persimmon. We continue with the exchange as planned, then. Very good. The structure across the river should serve our needs. We shall await you there with the conscripts. If you would bring your captives. Agreed. Until then, Ambassador. I have got such a bad feeling. Are they going to be alive? Are they going to be handed bodies? Oh man, it's a trap. It's a trap. There's more. I knew better than to trust Asahi, but that was a dirty trick. Still, unpleasant as it was, we have at least put the matter of Suyu's future to rest. I've sent her back to the Enclave with Yugiri to give Gosetsu his precious persimmon. Come, let us follow them. What's Alfino thinking? You have that look, Alfino. What is it? Oh, nothing of consequence, most like. We can discuss it upon our return. Hmm. Can we talk about it now, though? I'm a little impatient. Why do we have such a big party all of a sudden? We should pay a visit to Gosetsu and reassure him about Suyu's fate. He will want to know that the Empire has finally relinquished its claim on her. Gosetsu, are you awake? My lord, come in, come in! Oh, they are cozy up. <laughs> when Tsuyu returned, her eyes were red from weeping. Aww. She spoke not a word, simply sat and peeled some fruit she'd brought for me. She then claimed weariness and retired to her chamber. Tell me. What happened to upset her so? The ambassador arranged a surprise reunion with her foster parents. A misguided attempt to restore Yotsuyu to her senses. It was plain their presence caused her great distress, but she seemed otherwise unaffected. 
Yotsuyu was mistreated as a child, was she not? It was a cruel trick to use her tormentors like that, knowing the pain it could cause. Hmm. I like this Asahi less and less. I'll fuck him up with you, don't worry. Be that as it may, he has agreed to allow your to remain with us Not because of what he did to, to you, but because he called long. me ugly. Our primary concern now is to hand over the prisoners without incident and bring our people safely home. There was one other detail at the meeting which caught my attention. Mm. I assume you all noticed the rather suspect crates within the castrum. Mm -hmm. The Imperials were quick to retrieve them afterwards, but I wonder. Out with it, brother. You fear they might contain bombs or war machines? Does he think what I think? If the Ambassador wanted me dead, he has had ample opportunity. No, assassination is not his intent, but we should be on our guard for other acts of treachery. The bodies, there, there are gonna be bodies in there. Oh. My lord, forgive me, but the lady yachts to you. She's gone. Gun? I beg your pardons, my lords. I was certain she'd fallen asleep. No, no, the responsibility is mine. Twas I who gave her a room instead of a cell. She may simply have wandered outside. We will organize search parties. But he's such Might I call upon your assistance? Of course. I never say no to you. Oh no. Oh, just more cutscenes. Help. It's bait. It's bait, Pepper. Oh, oh. Are those the parents? Did, did Yatsu... Do you think... Oh my god. Help. Help me. I can't see you. It's going. To cry in the night? Good cardio. I was gonna hack a hairball. If only I hadn't remembered. He should hate me. Oh. But I will not suffer his kindness. Not after what I did to him. Who's there? <gasps> oh, it's you. What are you doing out here in the dark? This is the Enclave, is it? When the soldiers dragged us back to Doma, you were the last person I expected to see. You're the bane of our existence, Yotsuyu! A font of misery! You couldn't even do us the simple courtesy of dying, could you? Oh, no. You had to live and taint us with the shame of your failure. We had a perfect life in the capital. And now, 
They're making us wallow in this muddy ruin like common swine. I don't deserve this. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Now, now, dear, that'll do. There seems little point in berating the girl when she scarcely remembers her own name. Our time would be better spent contemplating how we're to survive this unhappy predicament. Is he gonna hit her? What's he doing? <laughs> You've kept your looks at least. I suspect you'd fetch a handsome price with the right buyer. Maybe enough to get us to Kugani and start a new business. <laughs> get his ass. Ah, my beloved parents. No sooner do I wake from gentle slumber than the world returns in all its cruelty. Yes, this is how it always was. How it was meant to be. Very well. If I cannot escape my nature, then I shall embrace it. To the very depths I have sunk, my soul steeped in spite and rotten to the core. The self-righteous hide behind justice, but I need no such mask. Father, mother, was it not you who made me into this monster? Who taught me the truth of this miserable world? For years I knew naught but the taste of pain and humiliation. But the time has come to savor my vengeance against Dorma. Against all my enemies. And it begins... With you! Y Yatsuyu! <laughs> Boy! <laughs> what? Okay, there's no way the blood would have splattered like that, but... I guess it's hot. I don't know. Get their ass! Get their ass! Oh, she looks haunting. Oh my god. Good for you. Good for her. Good for her. Her brother? Well done, dear sister. Did I not say you would come back to us? He played the long game. Brother dearest, what a surprise. You always were a cold-blooded little worm. I doubt you thought twice about sending <gasps> our parents to their death. Your dagger yet drips with their blood, and you presume to judge me. To be frank, I didn't think you had the strength to slay them so cleanly. A single thrust each. I'm impressed. She knows where to aim. But surely you can't be satisfied with murdering a pair of doddering elders. You yearn for a deeper vengeance, and the power to see it through. Oh my god. What is he unraveling? Oh, the mirror. Is it a mirror? Please. I don't want to die. Let him die. Okay, yeah, well. I don't want to die! Any sign of her? Yeah, I don't want to tell you this. What happened here? 
I knew what would happen if she recovered. And still, I did nothing. Oh, don't beat yourself up, Daddy. You say she left please. with her brother? <laughs> Whatever he wants with her, he was willing to pay for it with his parents' lives. They're just collateral. But <sighs> this is neither the time nor the place. We must gather the others. God damn. We have recovered the Nera the Nerus? Neir Neris's remains and will hold the cremation anon. Would they would that they had never again set foot in Doma. I broke the news to Gosatsu myself. He was quiet. I think it best that he be allowed some time alone with his thoughts. Lord Hien seems keen to take stock of the situation god i have no thoughts so my friends that which we feared has come to pass yet Siu has regained her memory and returned to the imperial fold it is by any measure a cruel twist not least for gosetsu but one which does not invalidate our agreement According to the terms of the contract, we were bound to surrender Yotsuyu into the Garlean's hands should her condition improve prior to the hour of the exchange. By that reckoning, all is, wait, all is, if not as it should be, then, as it must be. This I can accept. But what I cannot accept are the un... Unconsignable? Unconscionable? I don't fucking know that word. Lengths to which Asahi went to ah! Given his recent conduct and his apparent admiration for Xenos, it is plain he cannot be trusted. And that is to say nothing of the unexplained containers he insists on bringing to our meetings. Whatever the ambassador is planning, it, I think it unlikely our negotiations will end peacefully. In the event of hostilities, the safety of the conscripts must be our first concern. As such, I would have an escape route in place before the meeting begins. A wise precaution. If the main structure of Castor and Fluminus is to be the sage for the exchange, then I believe a thorough inspe inspection is in order. The Citadel has stood empty since ever since the Imperial withdrawal, while we took steps to ensure that it could not be defended by an, a, a, by an occupying force, it is entirely possible the Ambassador has arranged things there to his advantage. I will slip inside and make certain we have an obstructed exit. Pray allow me to join you. I have some experience of Imperial facilities, and should matters take a turn for the worse, I would hope to be of at least some use. Very good. That should be enough to guarantee us a way out of the castrum. Beyond that, however, we will need a ship to ferry the conscripts back to the Enclave. Even with every skiff we have, it would take several trips to evacuate everyone. A confederate Seki Sekibun? Sekibune? Sekibun? On the other hand, would require only a single run, and leave us far, far less vulnerable on the water. Assuming, of course, Rasho can be convinced to part with one. Might I take the lead on this? I've had dealings with Rasho and his pirates before. And I won't be alone, will I, Pepper? You can count on me? Yeah. Bye, Carnage! Take care! Much appreciated. I quite fancy parlaying with pirates again. It's such a sh it's just a shame Lise won't be there to reprise her role. Or reprise, I guess. Hm. I'm certain you would make a persuasive pair, but I think I will accompany you to these negotiations all the same. My lord, the ruler of Doma should not be seen consorting with common brigands. Come on now. Or come now, you giri. They stood with us at the Empire. Ag they stood with us against the Empire. If we would ask their aid once more, we must treat with them as equals. My presence shall serve to demonstrate our sincerity. Indeed, my lord. Pray forgive my presumption. Far leave, Master Alfino. Before I leave, Master Alfino and I shall be about our task. Should I get more Popeyes, chat? Should I get more Popeyes? I want more foods. Should I get more foods? And we should be on our way to Onokoro. Time is short and Rasho may take some convincing. Kumchi chicken! Kumchi chicken! Yeah! Kumchi chicken! Kumchi chicken! Snacky time! Snacky time! Snacky time! Snacky time! Yeah, I'm like, I'm craving some foodies. This whole time I've been sitting here like, mm, 
my dummy dummy kinda wants some fufu. I did send you the short king money earlier. You did. You sent me 50 buckaroos. So I guess I could use that for some chicken eggs. What about some McDonald's? I could get McDonald's. But they take a little bit longer. They almost always disappoint me. And their delivery fee is really high. Sorry, stay strong. I am strong. What about that water? I'm drinking it. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right. Do I do it? Do I do it? Do I do it? Do I get, okay. Do I get the McDonald's or do I get the Popeyes? Wow! For your Popeyes. For my Popeyes. Okay, I guess I'm getting Popeyes. Well, and it's better in your area. They are literally both across the street from me. So it's Popeyes. We're getting the Popeyes thanks to Dentist. You know what the nice part about this is? I can just hit the reorder button. I'll get the nugget combo again. Actually, wait. Should I get the nugget combo or should I get a sandwich as well? What if I get the nugget combo and a sandwich? Both? Both. Both is good. Both is good. And I'll get more mashed potatoes. Oh, someone just left a party. Why? Why would you leave a party? We're having such a good time. Sandwich. 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 I get a sandwich. A sandwich, eh? But they're all combos. Is there not a sandwich that's just the same? Oh, there it is. Ooh, do I get spicy? No, 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 no. If I get spicy, I will fucking die. I will actually pass away. Okay. Do I want a chicken sandwich? Remember back when we had to convince Sarah to prog this game? Now she's progging up a storm? Listen. Listen, I don't know what happened to me. Okay? I don't know what happened to me. But this game is my life now. It's literally the only game that I play. It's all I play now. Food? Why is there a food pole? Oh, Popeyes versus McD's nuts. Okay. Okay. Oh, should I get a dessert? Apple pie! Should I get six biscuits as well? Mm. Okay. I'm getting the eight piece nugget combo. <laughs> and six biscuits. Courtesy of Dentist. Thank you, dentist. All right. Ready? Okay. Oh, I just cracked my back. Oh. Oh. Oh, Voss said BRB. Wait, Melon, you said Ray. Ray isn't on. Ray's character isn't on right now. Okay. 
Okay. Anything for my brat queen? Yeah, that's me. Okay. Oh, my heating pad turned off. I was wondering why my crampy started feeling worse. Milk's gonna be hella dry? That's okay. I'll make some tea. Boss went to uh, change outfits. Why were they naked again? You'll see. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> but I guess I will see. Oh. Sarnix, are you giving me a button? What is this? Wow. Thank you. Thank you for that, um... Oh, I forgot! I got stuff! Thank you for that, um, that weapon, Sarn. Okay. I'm gonna see if I can put those on my Dragoon. Oh. I cannot carry what? More than one Dogie of Healing? Oh, pfft. Well, my bad. Oh, good! Good, I can't- I can't use any of them. Great. What did he give me? What is this? Oh, I could get this from the marketplace, I'm pretty sure, right? I think? No, not this one. Wait, no, I can! Suku- Suku Yomi, that's from one of the, um... The trials or the raids or something? Because I have that weapon, but for, um, my Astro. Look. See? Look how pretty it is. Don't let him lie. Don't let him lie. We have the next quest, Hops. Hope's making it immersive as fuck. Wait. Who's making what immersive? That's a uh, neat timing for that gif. Oh, are... Oh, are we- are we about to go- are we about to go face that person? IS THAT A SPOILER?! It's a limited Sarnix release! Don't kill me. Should I be Dark Knight? I don't know what's happening. You guys are making me nervous. Am I gonna have to go fight people? Is that why you're all here? Book. Are y'all on Gobby server? I'm on Gobby server. Just peep that. Yes! Well, not all of us, but the cool people are. The losers aren't. So. Look at the bottom left of the tooltips are. Look at the bottom left of the what? Me being promoted to of What do you want me to look at? It has... Look at the bot of the, the like the tool tip like this tip or the fact that it says your name. Oh Yeah, it's oh, yeah, you Yeah, I see that What about it? Is this an ego boost? Is that what this is? Who was it? Who was it that gave me a weapon that was so dog shit that I couldn't get rid of it? That was Sarnix, wasn't it? Wasn't it Sarnix? Yeah. <laughs> it was Sarnix who crafted me a weapon and he was like, use it, use it, use it. And it was so dog that I was pissed. Did I order my Popeyes? I did. Now there is a face I did not expect to see. What brings the... What brings the noble... The b b lord... B what brings the noble lord of Doma into the company of... Bilge rats, such as we? If you've come to offer Doma chains in place of Garlean ones, then I'm afraid you've wasted a trip. Ha 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 ha! And what fine subjects you would make with your fleet at our disposal, our restoration efforts would be hastened tenfold. 
But let us speak seriously. I stand before you not to demand your fealty, but to request your aid once more. I said glam it. Even worse! It was ugly! It was worse than the one that I was using! Mine was beautiful! <laughs> it was hideous! <laughs> May happy or confused. Don't miss the... <laughs> Like, Sarnix, your character may be hot as fuck, but that weapon? Babes, your taste? Not that good. I'm happy you were confused. Doma's liberation was but a means to an end. We aided you only to save ourselves. Now we have so mu we have no such incentive. We have sworn no oath to you and will not come running like hounds at their master's whistle. And I will not presume to treat you thus. I come to petition your cooperation as an ally of equal standing. Equal standing, you say? Seems a bit lopsided to me. Where is the profit for us in all of this? Profit? Must you always think in such short-sided terms? Have you ever heard of doing the right thing? Have you ever heard of pirates, little miss? You'll find we're simple souls. You pay our tithe. Is it pronounced tithe? You sail in peace. Deny us our due and we take it by force. We'll put you out of the water if we see you drowning, but we are not in the business of doing something for nothing. It's a good thing I have Sarnix's money. <laughs> babes, please! It's ugly, babes! <laughs> Calm yourself, Mistress Alize. We did not come here to moralize. We came here to talk, and there is more to be said. According to records recovered after liberation, Relatives of your domen born brethren were among those conscripted into the Imperial Army. And as you may be aware, we recently negotiated the return of said conscripts. Many, alas, will arrive to find no families waiting for them, no homes to grant them shelter. I would ask that you offer them a place in your in the Confederacy. You would not be rescuing strangers, but welcoming brothers and sisters into your ranks. And has not the Confederacy been in need of new recruits? <laughs> She's gonna be looking like new Yasha. I know, right? That's what I was saying. Isn't giving me the weapon a spoiler? Even though I already got some of the weapons from the market board because I saw them there anyways. <laughs> I'm not using it though. You seem well informed of our affairs, Lord Hien. The losses we suffered at the Garlean's hands are no secret, but since we drove them out of Doma, the Ruby- Do you- hold on. Do you- do you all remember that time? Some- and like, they were a viewer and it was all fun and games, but do you all remember that time that someone found me and I think El Amigo, and they were like, hey, your fit's ugly, here are some new clothes, put them on. Do you all remember that shit? That was hilarious. They gave me a full outfit and they were like, here. That was so funny. Because I remember Vosk was there too. They were like emoting and stuff and like doing Vosky Vosk things. And then this like Viera gave me new clothes and then drove off into the sunlight. <laughs> But since we drove them out of Doma, the Ruby Sea has come alive with traders and travelers. So many vessels attack, so few pirates attack them. It was brand new, so when in my when I was brand new, someone in my FC saw me in leveling leveling gatherers gear and was like, what is that? And immediately crafted me gear, that's so funny. Bet never getting a cent from me now. That's fine. I don't need your money. I have better swords! I don't need your doubloons! We could do with some more hands on deck, and doubly so if they're familiar with the inner workings of the Empire. It was cool though, I can't lie. I did kind of like the sword you gave me, but I'm not using it. Very well, the Confederacy agrees to your request. We will have your ship. Or you will have your ship. But before that, you must do something for me. The vessel I have in mind was damaged during your battle with the Empire. Though we have mended her, she has yet to be declared seaworthy. Oh my god, do not tell me you want me to fix your fucking boat. She's sound enough down below, but when you load her up with conscripts and the waterline rises, those upper planks had best be free of cracks. Assuming you want your people to stay dry, you will do me the favor of swimming across around the hull to check for weaknesses. 
That is, if Doman Lords are not averse to getting their robes wet. Oh, he'll get his wet. Not this Doman Lord. If we each inspect a third of the ship, it shall be done in a, in a trice. That's the spirit. The ship is moored at Quickscape Pier. Our apprentice shipwright will be on deck to hear your report. Look for a lad named Ihanashi. Ihanashi? And I thought, and I thought I had a knack for parlaying with pirates. For the record, my previous attempt was an unmitigated success, and yes, I should have quit while I was ahead. I don't need your money, just your subs and bits. Exactly. Well, well. I thought the rumors exaggerated, but the young lord lives up to his reputation. Yeah, he's hot! Doesn't that guy kind of look like Orlando Bloom? If his, like... If his hair was all brown, he would look like Will Turner. Wait. Where the fuck am I going? Down here? One second. Let me turn all of these off so I can navigate properly. Oh, it's north. It's up here. I go this way. Can I jump off? Please love Sarnex. Mm. Mm. Okay. You've convinced me. I love him again. Hi, CJ. With a few more polygons? Yeah, I can see it. It was in the giant pyramid ziggurat thing in the peaks. Yes, yes, it was, Voss. That's where it was. That's why you got a glam crafter gear with holiday stuff. For Halloween, I was pumpkin head with metallic orange leather jacket. Now I'm Santa. I love this for you. Oh. <gasps> Am I supposed to be going underwater? Nope, I just saw it. I gotta go back up. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Thank you. <laughs> the Madeleine has a cute Christmas outfit. I don't even want to see it. No, he's dead. Well, not all cats can swim, I guess. They're there. Supporting side quests to struggle. I know. Most of my side quests are like ether current stuff or job stuff. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Where's the other place you wanted me to check? Over here? Me. <laughs> you spot a small crack in one of the planks. Can I can I patch it up? No? It appears not. Alright. Where's the guy? Where's the guy? Oh, he's over there. I am the shipwright er shipwright er apprentice shipwright. Oh, I see. Did you find anything that might need attention? The section I inspected seems solid enough. On the port side near the bow, you say. Alright, I'll have a look and see what I can do. My apologies. I seem to have lag lagged behind. I could float in that gentle sea all day. Otherwise, I'm happy to report no visible cracking or holes in my section of the hull. You, 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 Lord Hien, the captain sent you to inspect the hall? Come, we have mercy. Forgive us the discourtesy, my lord. My lord. Ha, tis quite all right. In fact, I rather enjoyed it. I take it you are of Doma? Yes, my lord. The Imperials took my father away after the uprising. Oh my god, the Mughal necklace? I want that. And I had nowhere else to turn. The Confederacy became my family. But somehow told me they're releasing the conscripts now. Oh, but someone told me they're releasing the conscripts now. Maybe my father will be among them. Not that I can go back. There's no leaving once you've joined. How fair is our lady? Is she seaworthy? 
Captain, we, we found a small crack in the port side, but I'll have it fixed before you know it. I see if you met the boy. I see you have met the boy. Did he tell you his story? Did he tell you his story? He babbles when he's nervous. Should his father be among the conscripts as he hopes? I mean to give him the choice to leave this life. If he so chooses, I expect you to see they are provided for. I have heard that those who join the Confederacy forswear all ties with kin and homeland. Is that oath so easily put aside? If I allow it. I see in him the lad I was 25 years ago. You say the words, you mean them. But the yearning for home still lingers. It's giving Roban. My family is long dead, and I know this life is my lot. But he has scarce dipped his toes with us. If there is a life for him in Doma, he should have the chance to live it. Well said. The Empire's conquest has uprooted many and more. Be it in Yansha or out on the Ruby Sea, we have a duty to ensure that Ihanashi and others like him are free to dwell where they desire. And the matter is settled. I'll make preparations to cast off. Well, my friends, it seems we have our ship. Let's return to the Enclave. I love how much of a bro he is. He's just like, hi, I'm just a little guy. I love him. I know! I know. Hien is truly just a little fella. He is just some guy. And I love him. I love him so much. Um, where do I? Where? Ah! There we go. Oh, I gotta fucking go back there. Yeah, no, Hien, uh, he's a very sweet character. He... Waldo? He's got the same energy that Orshifon has, which, like, scares me. Teleport offer on screen. Oh. Did I miss it? <laughs> Did I... Did I... Hey, he's just a little guy. He and is just some little dude. He's got that big supportive sweetheart energy. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I love characters like that. I know that... I know that it's, like, super cliche, but it is, like, really nice to see characters that are just, like, all around good people. You know? They're all around our Hanako, this one, not, oh yeah, you're not playing on Kojin. Um, they're all around good people, want to see the best in everybody, but are also like very down to earth and funny. They're super, super, super cliche, but I feel like in narratives like this, they break it up quite a bit. Yeah, they're, ni they're like a nice warm hug for the heart. That's a very good way of putting it. They're like a bowl of soup on a cold winter day. Welcome back, Hexagon! It seems Yugiri and Alfino completed their task before us. They have been waiting. We scoured the structure and determined the swiftest path to safety. In the event of hostilities, we will lead the conscripts outside with all possible haste. From there, the Confederacy has pledged a ship to ferry us across the One River. Now we have but to attend the exchange and pray to the Kami these precautions were unnecessary. Hmm. I don't want any of these, but I will take the purple one because it's purple. <laughs> ah! Uh, I don't like how that looks. Hien is ready to proceed with the prisoner exchange. Well, we were putting our contingency plans in place. I left Hakuro in charge for organizing transport of, for the Imperial prisoners. You will see they arrive at the appointed hour, leaving us free to rendezvous with our Confederate allies. Come, they await us on the riverbank not far from the castrum. Oggy. You know what? You know what? A mug of hot chocolate? No, 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 Nixie. A mug of hot chocolate is my sweet boy. That's my sweet boy. And no one can take that from him. That's my hot chocolate boy, okay? Don't worry. No one's replacing you, honey. I promise. I gotta pull up your... Your apron again is falling off. 
You keep bopping your mic and I keep thinking somebody's banging on my roof because I'm hearing a headset. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, I'm bopping my mic. I'm not even touching my mic or like with my hand. Wait, what mic am I is being picked up? No, oh, okay, the right one. Really? Was it from when I was playing with Orshifa? That's weird. Or is it from like hitting my desk? Who's upstairs in my empty house? That's terrifying. I don't like that. I promise everything is okay. Wait, am I here? I am. Okay. Uh. Uh. Wait. Am I here? Can I just? Can I just? Can I just? Uh, uh. I'm do a little TP. <laughs> I'm not sure, but it kept scaring me. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry for giving y'all the spooks. I mean, it is in my username. Okay, hold on. Let me see my... <gasps> my phone is not here yet. They said estimated arrival was 11.20, but now they're... <gasps> but now they're saying 11.30. Hemk! That's okay, though. Just remember, if Jordan Peele has taught you anything, fist fight anyone that looks just like you but wears a red jumpsuit. I have not seen that movie yet. Uh, that was, um, was that Nope? No, 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 no. That was Us, right? I think it was called Us? Oh, was that it? Was that the sound? When I, like, elbowed my mic? Wow, I'm so glad that when I when I rotate the the cam, it doesn't even it doesn't show us at all. <laughs> That's good. This is this is good. Yeah, I still need to watch that movie. I heard it was really good. I just haven't gotten around to it yet. I don't even know if it's like streaming on anything. Your party is assembled then. Aye, and ready for what lies ahead. I trust. Lest there be any confusion, though, the tower across the water is to be the scene of the exchange. That and whatever else Asahi has planned. But regardless of the ambassador's intentions, we will bring we will bring our people home. Yuguri, you are to evacuate the conscripts at the first sign of trouble. Yes, my lord. We, meanwhile, shall cover their escape and lend what support we can. I keep going in between the accents. I'm so sorry. Your ship awaits you at the Castrum's loading docks. She will see you safely home. Oh, you finished Wednesday? Oh, how was it? I'm going to watch it with the community, so hopefully we can pick a date to do that. It'll probably have to be, like, on Wednesday next week. That's good! Yay! I was a little bit nervous when they announced the show. Like, I was excited, but, you know, rightfully so. Nervous about how the ad adaptation would go. But the cast is so good that I had so much faith. I had so much faith in, in the actors, so. Imagine and watch just to see your reactions. Sounds good. I mean, you may as well just like hang out with us anyways, right? Then I'll stand ready to play their part. Come, let us be about it. Oh, is it is it cutscene time? Checking my food. The music. I'm scared. I have a feeling they're all gonna be fucking dead. I don't trust this at all. At last, the hour has come. The conclusion to these negotiations will mark a new beginning for Dorma and the Empire. A first step on the road to peaceful coexistence. Indeed. We are ready to proceed with the exchange when you are. <clears throat> Forgive my curiosity, Ambassador, but... Is there a purpose I'm telling you, the bodies are in there. With you? 
I'm telling you, the bodies are oh, in there. The supply crates. They are filled with materials we hoped might be of use in Dorma's restoration. But that'd be too dark. I meant to gift them to you at our last meeting, but we had so much else to discuss. I feel like that would be too dark. How very generous. I confess I had not expected such compassion. Welcome though it is. But then I was also surprised by the news that one of our captives had delivered herself into your custody ahead of time. A minor discrepancy I shall overlook in the spirit of the occasion. Are you perhaps referring to me, Lord Hien? She got the long drag too. Yotsuyu. Oh my god. Orphan of the Nayuri, widow of Sashihai, and acting viceroy of Dorma. You and your people are mine to govern, mine to punish. Don't fold, brother. Well, well. It's no not November. It would seem your shattered mind is mended. As per our agreement with the ambassador, you are free to return with him to the Empire. Your authority as acting Viceroy, however, is no longer recognized here. Long drag. <laughs> My position is not for you to decide, little lordling. All who resist the rule of the Empire must be purged. Such was the order given to me by Lord Zenos himself. Big reveal. Uh-huh. I will reign here in this putrid, pestilent swamp until the last of you has been broken. Yeah, what is that? There's no way that's just a mirror. This <laughs> land shall know no dawn. I will spew forth darkness and drown all in eternal night. And high above you I shall shine, uncaring, cold and distant as the moon! Is she? She... Oh no, oh no, oh no! What has you done? Oh gods, this is a summoning. No! <laughs> oh. Well, but is she going to be a mommy? Remember all those things I said about you before? A dormant citizen has called forth an Where? icon in direct violation of our primary agreement. The negotiations have failed. Abandon the captives and make preparations to withdraw. Anybody else barking? <laughs> but Ambassador! Disobey me, Pylos, and you disobey the Emperor. Make God, preparations to withdraw! Fucking... Good. 
As you come but up. I want to see her again. Show me her again. Please. Just the, just the little tease. Fuck! He is flabbergasted. My lord, you must fall back! You ask me to run? Leave this to me. A strategic withdrawal. Spare my pride, would you? I know this foe is beyond me. The field is yours. My ego? We will withdraw, but not without our countrymen. I want every soul accounted for. Every soul! My lord. I still think they're gone. I like how they just leave me. They just leave me to one I knew her. you would not flee. <laughs> I see now the strength which flows from that baleful light of yours. But I am become Tsukuyomi, goddess of the moon and divinity of night. Is it Tsukiyomi or What Tsukiyomi? power can compare to such celestial majesty? I shall plunge all I despise into darkness! And within that black abyss, even your light shall flicker and fail. Jeez. Come, let us cast a storm. A look upon the fate of Dorma. I see a future in which the sun sets on this wretched land. Once and for all! I'm a little intimidated. I'm also a little flabbergasted. Oh, oh, she's so pretty. Why does she have to be so hot? I'm trying to hate the bitch. I'm trying to hate her. Pepper is fighting her inner demons right now. Okay. I just got to I just got to check on my on my Popeyes. Oh. That's not my Popeyes. Oh, it's almost here. All right. Should I? Oh, party lead. Okay. Should I wait for my, I'm gonna wait for my Popeyes and then we'll dive in. Ugh, cover me in uh, cover me in darkness and want me. Okay, who am I inviting? Gain? Gain, are you are you here? Um, who was it that I was inviting? Does Voss need a reinvite? Question mark. Cannot locate a, a, a character with that name? Okay, I guess not. You're out, you're out. Okay, so Pepper Fart. Pepper Fart, okay. Is that it? Warren? Oh. Wait for my food? Yeah. Did I win yet? No, I'm still losing. Go up to the stairs. Oh, can I go up there? <gasps> I can kind of go up here. I can't really. I can't really do anything. What feet? Feet? Yo, they're giving us free toes. Free toes. Oh, Genesis. Genesis. I have. I have you added, right? Where are you? Did I pass you? Oh, there you are. I cannot, I cannot add you apparently. You're in Zalera? I think that's why. Oh, guys, spamming the screenshot button the moment the toes. <laughs> that's so funny. That's so funny. I G post here for so long. I believe it. I believe it. I think the only, like, boss G-pose that I've ever done was, I think, 
Pepper and Nidhogg. I think that was the only one I did. I still can't invite you, Genesis. Can I do it from here? Oh. Well, I could do it from there, apparently. Cool beans! Um, do I tank this? Or do I dragoon this? What do I do? Oh my back. Tank it? Alright. Not because of the feet, though? <laughs> Alright. Um... Hello? My Uber, my Uber delivery man went the other way on his bike with my, with my foods. What the hell? Alright, we'll wait a little bit. <sighs> it's you and Sarnix, easy peasy. Sarnix is tanking? Sarnix isn't gonna be a ninja to flex on everybody and be cool? And Sophia G pose was different? What is, what is, who's Sophia? What does that mean? What does that mean? She's an extra Heaven's Word trial? Oh, I didn't really unlock a lot of things, so. I joined, but I'm helping a friend here on my world. Oh, that's fine. We're full now. I'm cramping so fucking bad, y'all. Oh my god. So, am I still in 4.3? <laughs> Sophia's made of ebony? Like the ore? Ooh. This is the end of 4.3. Two more quests after this trial. Onyx? Ooh. That's neat. I like that. So she's a hard mommy. A stone cold mommy, if you will. And then 14 quests of Shadowbringers. All right. Do you think we can get closer tonight? If I have 14 more quests, how many do you think y'all, how many do y'all think I can get through? Come on, have some faith. There are a lot of cutscenes, that's okay. Zero? Banned. You could do all 14 if makeup comes off. That's actually true. That is actually true. If all my makeup is off, I can... Please do all of them, Jen. Well, since you said please, I can't say no to you. <laughs> all right, where are my nuggies? All right, he's here. Lately, the front desk has been super frustrating because they're not letting food delivery people up, but my guy's coming. Yeah, Popeyes has nuggets. How come y'all didn't know this? This is the second time I've ordered nuggets from Popeyes on stream and y'all have been like, what? Popeyes has nuggets? Like, yes. Is it a Canadian thing? Maybe only in Canada? Maybe. You know what? Let me look this up. Popeye's Nuggets Canada. Are Popeye's Nuggets in Canada? Okay. Popeye's Nuggets are in Canada. Exclusive. No, they literally just have nuggets. I never see them near me. Really? No, they have them here. There you go. So it's not a Canadian exclu exclusive. Y'all just are going to the wrong Popeyes. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. You should listen to her delivery in Japanese. I'll have to check it out. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of like how wobbly the ears are. They feel a little bit more expressive. You know? Like, what? What do you mean? What's going on? <laughs> 
It might be a franchise thing. Oh, you know what? That could be it. That could be it. The owner of the locations are probably like, mm, not here. It's not going to sell. We'll hear, etc., etc. I really want to replay this game, like maybe New Game Plus in Japanese. Um, most games that I play, I normally pick the dialogue that is like the origin of where the game is produced. Like that kind of bullshit. Imagine not choosing Nuggies. I know. I don't trust people. I don't trust people who look at things like chicken nuggets from McDonald's and like, mm, nuggets, I'm too, I'm too good for that. I was like talking to this guy for a little bit and he judged me for going to McDonald's. He judged me for getting a McDonald's burger because it was like beneath him and it was cheap fast food and I was like look I know you're the son of a billionaire but ease up buddy okay the shits after a McDonald's burger are so worth it if you can't go on a bender with me and then get cheap as fuck takeout immediately after you're not the one. And you never will be. Okay? With that fucking attitude- Yeah, go again! No one beneath it with that fucking attitude! You're so right! <gasps> Guess what's here? Manus. Oh my god. I literally- I- I can't- I don't know what it is about these ears that give me so much confidence, but like, they're just so cute. irrational fear of mine <laughs> respect the commitment thank you um a really irrational fear of mine is that when i open the door to pick up my food someone is going to come around the corner and shoot me i always feel like i'm gonna get attacked i don't know why and so sometimes what I'll do is I'll wait, like, a little bit for my food. Like, I'll wait for, like, the delivery person to leave, you know? Like, I'll wait maybe, like, two minutes, usually. That way I know I'm safe. Alright. Oh. Ignore all my boxes, please. I them to leave so they don't see me creeping and grab the food. <laughs> That's also completely fine. Okay, well, look who else is creeping. Look who just woke up. You just woke up because you smelled mama's food? Yeah? Look at this little man. Look at this little man. He thinks because he's cute he's going to get my food? Oh. He just like me for real. Hi, boo boos. Hi. Oh, he do a shrimp. Come here. You want? Do you want to smell my chicken? Do you want to smell my chicken? Where's my sauce? Oh, I'm. I need my sauce. Why are Popeye's bags so hard to open? Ayo? Ayo?
got no sauce. I got no sauce, Waldo. He was late, got lost, and forgot the sauce. I'm so sad now. Now I gotta use my sauce. Sponsored, by the way. This is karma for shitting on my gifts. I'll shit on them again, bitch. That means losing sauce. I'm chill. I know they always forget the sauce. I'm gonna have my dry nuggies. I mean, at least I have my mashed potatoes. But I have no spoon. And you know what? Look how much space is in here. They could have put my sauce in there. Blueberry habanero does slap. It's really yummy. Okay. I got a spoon. I got a spoon. I like how my entire party has just been like idling, waiting for this trial to begin. Hold on, I have to see that this these nuggies will taste good with the sauce. Hold on. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's really fucking spicy. But it works. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Alright. Is my party ready? Music though? Who doing what? Pepperfont, are you serious? What do you mean who doing what? Did y'all not assign your roles? biscuits and the sauceless chicken nug would have been drier than the Sahara Desert. I know. This is rough on me, but we ball. I'm sorry, you mean to tell me I waited this long for Sarnix to bail? Bite of my biscuit? Not you, Waldo. Not you, Waldo. Is he DCing? They need honey? Bet. I will get you some. Some honey. There's another bite. <clears throat> okay, can I fucking cue now? Is Sarnix done flirting with Jin?
Can I kill? Something fruity is going on. Fuck mommy up. Wrong thing. That's okay. We're fine. We're fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I know what I'm doing. He just said, oh, it's gonna be a long night, mommy? Let's share the torment, mommy? What's she doing? What is she, what is she doing? Oh god. What is she doing? Do I get out of this? I like how CJ said, I'm a mentor, I'm not gonna help you, and there's the first to die. Jin is on heels? Since when? Why is she smoking on all of us? Hello? I wouldn't want the pain to go familiar. Ooh, that was dark. Transforming? Is she going into her second phase? It feeds on my spite, on my suffering. Oh. This is so spooky. Oh. 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 Um. What's? Oh. What's? What's? Oh. What's? Uh, what's going? What? What is happening here? Am I killing her mother? Is that her mother and dad? This is this is a this is kind of dark. This is this is so sad. Is that her brother? deliver judgment for my failure? Oh, Jesus. Jesus Christ! Oh. Hello? Hello? Let's go Setsu and Xenos. Hello? The drama? Can be no redemption. No shade, girl, but I agree. Ooh. 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 Oh my god. What? She's back. She's back. In darkness, begins the spider lives. 
Oi? Oi? What? Oh, should I? Should I? Should I? What? Do I move? What is happening here? What is? What is this? What? What is this? What is that? What is that? What does that do? What does that mean? What does that mean? Ah! Oh, I didn't die. We're chilling. We're good. Facing me this entire time. Is Sarnik's main tanking her? That bitch. That little bitch. Okay, what the fuck do I? What do I do here? What do I do here? What does that mean? What is? What does this mean? What does this mean? Three stacks move sides? Three stacks move sides? I don't know what that means! Move sides one side! There are sides? I, uh, oh, eight, oh. Oh my god. I'll grind you under my heel. That is huge. got her ass whooped. This is so- Where are we? Her hair is white now! Girl, get away from the body. Please don't tell me we're gonna forgive her after this too. Please tell me she's just dead now.
Like karma or no? It was the fucking kid. Oh yeah, it couldn't have been him. Ah! Oh! In her titty. Not me. You Spare really me. must learn to finish the job. Tis true that a gaudy mirror and a handful of crystals make for a feeble summoning. But even the weakest icon is a god of sorts. A threat that must be put down. Okay, I was working on it, okay? My, my! Such hostility! These beings are the sworn enemies of the Empire. I merely did my duty as an Imperial officer. Will you surrender to anger then? Slay an anointed emissary to avenge a fallen foe? Ha! You cannot, of course! To do so would burn the bridges we have labored so hard to build. He very much oh, is giving Joffrey. But I'm forgetting. They're already ash. This doorman woman has seen to that. The Empire cannot ally itself with any nation that refuses to renounce summoning. I believe I was most clear on that point. <laughs> Get his ass, Pepper. It should have been mine. The power he bestowed upon her. I should have been the one to govern Dorma. I would have repaid his faith. Just spoiled little brat. No one alive loves him more than I. Okay, I get it. You're fruity. Chill. Instead, this harlot betrayed his trust. Useless piece of filth. Worthless whore. Oh my god. Thank you, dear brother, for this precious gift. Vengeance. I wanted to do it. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. He got shish kebobbed! Like I These said! People he got shish kebobbed! They ignore the corruption which festers beneath the surface. Cast aside that which is dirty and broken. Speak not of things which would disrupt their dreary little lives. Like you, Asahi. Always pretending not to see. You were the first. The first I swore to kill. <laughs> Such bliss. I had thought my hunger insatiable, but now, now I am satisfied. You know what? Good for her. You should feel honored, dear brother. I saved the last of my strength. Just for you. That's a fucking badass line.
Damn. Two birds, one stone, I guess. Pepper, let her ass die. What's the matter? The Witch of Doma will soon be dead. Pepper, what are you thinking right now? <sighs> Gosetsu will mourn you. Sue, you deserved a kinder fate. Sue, you deserved a kinder fate. You're right. But look at what what happened. You know, Yotsuyu is not a good person. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with Gosetsu will mourn you, because he will. I am sure he's heartbroken. I know. I know it's not her fault. I know it's not her fault. Her character is very sad. But I'm- I just... I don't know. I don't know. I will go with Gosetsu will mourn you. I know I'm just a sip! Using your trauma as an excuse to being a he piece of shit? Yeah. See, perhaps. Yeah. That's, that's kind of my head space I wonder, here. Was the fruit as sweet as he I've remember? met a lot of like people who are fucking awful and do not care about how shitty of a person they are because of the way they were raised or because of like what life has dealt them, you know? And I gotta say my biggest gripe so far is that so many of the villains that are being handed to us um like the game keeps trying to humanize them Zenos. and i don't want to i don't want to be i don't want to feel sorry like yes she get she got amnesia yes it's very sad but look at what just happened <laughs> like I don't know. I don't think don't that makes us. up for all the shit that she's done. I am at your disposal. For Dola, however, learn to. Asai, you were born of Doma. Yes. Why is he so grumbly? Yes, my lord. I am. Honored that you would remember me. How may I serve? CJ, is this what you want to fuck? You are hereby appointed ambassador plenipotentiary and empowered to speak the with the voice of the hear? emperor. Return to your native land of Doma and announce your intention. Okay, girl. To sue for peace. For peace? Once negotiations are underway, you are to locate the acting viceroy. Mm. Mm. She lives? Mm. Uh, that is to say, I will, mm. my lord. When you have found her, you will initiate a ritual to call forth an icon. Mm. I will instruct you in the necessary steps. Yotsuyu's faith is unreliable. But as a child raised to believe in the kami, she will serve as a vessel for one of the Kojin's gods. She need only wish it to be so. Mm, I see. There was no way this kid was the that The power smart. will seem a gift, but the icon's essence will consume mm. her. She will be no more than a husk, a mm. slave to whim and desire. Mm.
My lord, ever since the day you saw fit to save my miserable life, I have dreamed of repaying your benevolence. This is how y'all talk to me. Upon my honor, I swear to devote to myself wholly to your service. Where am I supposed to All that like you this? command will be done, no me matter and the who? cost. Me and who? But. But. I fear the subtleties of your plan yet elude me. From the reports I have heard, the champion who aids the Dolmen resistance would make short work of a single icon. The icon is merely a message. The pacifist teachings of the Popularis spread through this city like a plague. Popularis, okay. And I would remind the people of the threat we face. Shit. You will be my chosen agent. The hand which tolls the warning bell. The salvation of this world will I not be like won I feel like this is setting up Shadowbringers like completely, treaties. right? That's the vibe I'm getting. Your chosen agent. I will not fail you, my lord. You did just get a shish kebab, though. So you kind of did. My, my master, Lord Xenos, he will come for you. Oh, he's gonna come for me? He's gonna be a good boy. Sorry. <laughs> you have prevailed, I see. Oh no. Oh, here we go. Oh. She is gone. Wherefore did the Kami spare us only to inflict this pain? <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> oh. oh, the bodies are gone. Death shall not want for company this day. You spared us a worse disaster. But I fear our fledgling peace with the Empire was beyond saving. Lord Hien! Oh. What's all this then? Maxima, is it not? I assumed you long fled. I entertain thoughts of escape even now. But our negotiations have yet to reach a satisfying conclusion. The ambassador insisted that the summoning spelled an end to our mission here. But it seemed to me there was more to the tale. We saw a vision of Asahi's past, Xenos. Yeah, Xenos was behind this plot. Gotta, they don't gotta know I saw a vision. I have heard tell of this power you wield. And in your vision, you witnessed Lord Xenos okay, mind, giving these orders. I had a vision, regardless. And how can that be? Xenos is dead. He took his own life after the battle in Alameda. Well, guess what, I honey? I saw his body with my own eyes. Forgive me, but Lord Xenos is very much alive. He granted our party an audience prior to our departure. That he was gravely wounded is certain, but his recovery appeared to be proceeding apace. How did he recover so I'm afraid I share Lord Hien's confusion. Yeah. The man's death was confirmed and his remains interred. These are matters I'm of so public confused. record. What don't we know? Hmm. I have no doubt you believe what you say. But what then is the explanation? 
that an imposter has infiltrated the innermost circle of the Imperial Court. The idea is inconceivable, absurd, but worthy of investigation nonetheless. Our movement can ill afford to have a highly placed pretender undermining our efforts. Do you think that's what it is? Your efforts may yet bear fruit. Tell me, what is to become of our prisoner exchange? Though we have already taken custody of our conscripts, we have yet to release your Imperial comrades. Do you still intend to collect them? Ah, uh, uh, yes. As the late Ambassador's second in command, it falls to me to speak on the Empire's behalf. And I'm happy to confirm our intent to proceed according to the original agreement. Then let us be about it. Twould be a pity to abandon such a promising beginning. Indeed. You have my thanks, Lord Hien. As soon as our people are secure aboard our airship, we shall depart straightways for Garlemald. Tread lightly, Pylus. I sense treachery awaits you there. Might I accompany you to the capital? Oh. Alphano, have you gone mad? Imposter or no, if Xenos was instructing Asahi on the finer points of ritual summoning, then experience tells us there is an Asian waiting in the wings. Without our knowledge and expertise, our new friends will be hard pressed to contend with a foe for whom death is but a minor inconvenience. They need our help. Were you indeed willing to share your knowledge of this enemy, we would not shun your counsel. You truly mean to do this? In full knowledge of the danger? Alfie, no! I have seen the Warrior of Light risk her life on countless occasions. Next to her, I'm scarce more than a distraction on the battlefield. But in the meeting room or the audience chamber, there I can make a difference. I can strike bargains, forge ties, and change minds. And where better to do these things than in the home of our old enemy? I mean... This is your moment! I believe in you, Alf. You know, you know what? I mean, he's right. I think he would excel. But my fear is that Alfino is still... A young, bumbling guy. Teen, you know? Like, he's not... I don't know. I'm scared. But also, he is a smart cookie. This is your moment. <coughs> this is your moment. I got the burpees. <laughs> Tis not for me to stop you. But I would have you Excuse consider me. an alternative arrangement. Rather than braving the Empire as a simple traveler, <laughs> go forth as an moment. emissary of Thorma. Oh my god. Uh, Such a position should offer you like some Spoken like a true junk, junk meow, drunk girl. <laughs> go then. You've obviously made up your mind. Oh, she's better. Just try not to do anything reckless, mm -hmm. alright? Be a good boy. I shall be on my best behavior. Farewell, my friends. Godspeed. I'm nervous. This game just makes me nervous and nervous and nervous. He's gonna be okay. Alfie knows gonna be fine. What's the worst that could happen to Alfie? He's not gonna get shish kebab, right? Yeah, he's still the baby man. He baby boy. The debate nerd, no. I knew I saw he was planning some manner of treachery, but a summoning? Thank the Kami you were here, my friend. None of us would have escaped Yotsuyu's vengeance had you not intervened. She was upon I, but she still had a choice, and she chose to submit to the ambassador's plan. His little wonder Gosetsu departed in silence. I gather he left the same way he came, alone aboard a rowing boat. As for the conscripts, most made it to the Sekibu Sekibune? Sekibun? Uh, before the battle began in the earnest, but the vessel yet waits on the riverbank for those who did not flee in time. And I suggest we put this doleful place behind us and make for the enclave together. So it'd be a shame to miss the joyous reunion. Oh. 
reminded me of a Chris D'Elia set. Oh man, I hate that man. I used to love his comedy, but I hate him as a person. And now, like, I feel bad if I ever, like, laugh at his stuff. But the drunk girl's like, what do you mean? What are you doing? Yeah, I got a lot of my humor from him once upon a time. <laughs> Often have I imagined this moment. Thank you for helping it come to pass. I'm glad I could have helped. <sighs> I take my thanks and kisses and head pats. Me. Actually, me. <laughs> hmm? Oh. They all do a bow, they all say thanks. We love some honor, we love some respect. Is that it? No. Oh. Oh, how's he feeling? Ah, there you are. Oh, he's in his old go- Gosetsu, your hair. My friend, what have you done? She's like, you look horrendous. Isn't that a thing? Like, you cut your hair? Um, like when you've- An old man who cannot raise his blade has no place in the service of a young lord. It's like, isn't that a thing? Like, you, Thus you cut your hair- Thus did I decide to devote my remaining days um, to pilgrimage. For like a new beginning? I will walk this land. Offering prayers of repose for all the souls who left this life in suffering. Yeah. All of them? Safe travels, Gosatsu. Safe travels. I'm not gonna pry. He'll do as he wishes. <laughs> A fulsome farewell makes for an enjoyable journey. Scarcely have we said our goodbyes to Alphano and you leave us too. But tis well that my companions find their own way forward. I must endeavor to do the same. I have faith that you will find the best path for Dorma without me, my lord. Pray forgive me this last act of selfishness, and grant me your blessing. You have earned it a thousand times over. Go in peace, my friend. I shall make of Dorma a land where children laugh, and none need live in fear. There is no better way to honor those who went before. And then me. 
Hello. <laughs> and with that, I take my leave. One thing that I noticed that this game has been doing more frequently, and I think this started after Heaven's Word or like during Heaven's Word, is they'll have the characters like actually make eye contact with you, like almost breaking the fourth wall kind of. And it real it really brings me into some of the moments, you know, like whether it's an enemy or a companion. It does something. It it gives it that like oomph. Ah, Gosatsu. Fair journey to you, my friend. Bittersweet occasion, but there is yet ample cause to be grateful. Pray join us in the Kian Khan. I would thank you properly. Immersion! My immersion! <laughs> yeah, it does. It does make it more personable. The game is about you and not just you being there witnessing it all. Yeah! It does kind of like feel funny that like my choices don't necessarily matter. Like even when they give me choices, I'm kind of like force fed things, you know? Do you ever get a hair that like you feel like needs to like come out? Okay, I got it. I'm shedding a ton right now. <laughs> Look at you being a good little POV, you so damn cute. Ooh, ooh. Our brothers and sisters are returned to us, and the dream of Dolma's restoration is that much closer to being realized. It is a day that will live long in the memory, and one that would never have dawned without the courageous actions of the Scions. On behalf of Dolma and her people, we give you our deepest thanks. Unless you think me complacent, I assure you, I have not forgotten the dark cloud on the horizon. The Xenos lives is a source of grave concern, mayhap the gravest, yet there is little to be done but wait for Alfino to send word. Until then, I plan to devote myself to fulfilling the promise I made to Gosetsu by building a nation in which none need live in fear. I confess I miss him already, but the thought that he has at last found peace goes some way to softening the blow. I wonder, did you ever stop to ask yourself why he showed Yotsuyu such kindness? I believe I can already see where this is going. I believe the answer lies in past tragedy, specifically the death of his wife and his daughter during the invasion. Though he hid it well, they were never far from his thoughts, and in Yotsuyu's childlike mien, I believe he saw not a fallen tyrant, but the little girl Fuck the little girl something something something. After the loss of his family, Gosetsu devoted himself wholly to the service of his country. He suffered any hardship, strove beyond the limits of endurance without hesitation or complaint. Though Suyu could never truly replace his daughter, I had hoped that with her at his side he might live out the remainder of his days in relative contentment. Aww. What that the kami had been so minded, even now I labored to discern any meaning in Yotsuyu's fate, to deliver her from certain death with no memory of her sins, only to leave her at the mercy of her stepbrother? Can that truly have been their will? That I cannot tell you. The will of the kami is not for us to know. But what I do know is that for a brief moment, a girl known as Suyu lived among us, and that she brought with her a whisper of respite for a grieving heart. Okay, so I think like that's my thing with Yatsuyu. It's that like I don't like I I I felt for her, but I don't I can't excuse any of her actions. But it's Gosetsu that I feel mostly for because he is good. <laughs> you know? I don't know. I don't care what the game is. I have such trouble siding with villains who just like are continuously bad. If that makes any sense, like, she had a moment where maybe, like, things could, like, change, like, change for the better, but no. 
<sighs> her priorities laid elsewhere and she couldn't not that she had to let go of her trauma but like it just it was too much you know and like so be it right man girl kisser 420 what's up she is a really well written villain no i agree no doubt in that like i like her as a villain you know but like i can't you know she's one of those and she's one of those i feel bad for her in a trial that got to me so much yeah it uh it's hard it's been hard listening in on her past to how men spoke to her let alone her father you know Ugh. 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 hi quinn what's up i have and always will be a villain fucker i feel like i'm less of a villain fucker and more of just a monster fucker you know i've noticed i've noticed that so far. <laughs> yeah, I mean, villains are cool. I'd fuck some of them, but monsters, however. Souls is the exception. Look, okay, you know what? Look, I feel like I feel like some people don't know this about me. I love Solus as a character and as a villain. I think he is incredibly well written, but I don't like him. I I I ship Solavellan. I love Solavellan. I think it is heartbreaking. But my head canon is that like my my character hates him by the end of it, and she wants to end him. You know, there's none of that. You know. I, don't, I think Solus is also past the point of redemption. You try telling him, Oh, you don't have to do this, you don't have to. Yes, I do. Love, Alan. You know? I'd like the Four Lords trial. That's what I've been told. I gotta do it. Apparently there are monsters that I'd like to fuck there. <laughs> she doesn't know? What do you mean? What do you mean? Yes, I do, Vanon. Stop it. Whenever somebody calls me Vanan, I like quiver and like in a like sometimes in a good way, sometimes in a bad way. If someone calls me Vanan in a way to try to like. I guess like be romantic or turn me on. It's like, no. No. <laughs> no. I'd, I had someone do that to me a couple of times and I was like, this has to end. Habibti. Oh, if you call me Habibti. Oh, I'm in. I'm in. Sarah so about to go hunting her very own bestiary in a different way. Yeah. <laughs> if y'all start seeing some bad dragon um, statues behind me, don't worry about it. I think it's time we were going, don't you? We've done all we can here and we have a lot to report. Before we head back to the Rising Stones, let's call in at Rolger's Reach. We should be the ones to tell Lise about Xenos. After all, we went through to What did she say? <laughs> oh! I just realized I could read all of the chat here. Or all the text here. Uh, after all we went through- After all we went- After everything we went through together, we owe her that. Okay, cool. Got it. So- So now- Okay. Okay, so now we're going to Rolgers Reach. Which is in Girabania. Yes. In Albania! Alright, here we go. What does Hab uh, Habibi mean? Just means like darling. My love, you know? I have 16 more quests. Do you think I could do it? Do you think we could get through? I've been live for four and a half hours, and it is currently 12.30. Fuck. I'll be here the whole ride. Good boy. My Egyptian friend called me Habibi all the time. Oh, 
she moved to Alberta? Do you guys still talk? Honestly, no, it gets long. Alright, so y'all say there are 16 more quests, but like, how long are those quests? That's the, uh, that's the, uh, big question here. And makeup off? No, I look too cute. Pepper, Alize, you're back. Hmm? No Alfie now? It's good to see you, Lise. As for my headstrong brother, he's off on what will almost certainly turn out to be a once-in-a-lifetime trip to Garlemald. It's a long story, but we have evidence that Xenos might still be alive. What? Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. What? But that's... If this is a joke... Gods, this had better be a joke. <laughs> 16 more quests, but like how many dungeons, how many trials, and how many soul duties? Exactly. Exactly. What's the vibe, you know? Three hours? That, I could... I could... No. Look, I know what I saw, right? We all saw it. And here you are, saying he's alive and well and living the high life back in Garlemald. I know how ludicrous this sounds. I'm still having difficulty believing it myself. But while I might doubt the word of an Imperial envoy, I'm inclined to trust Peppers. She saw the Crown Prince through the Echo in a meeting that could, could only have taken place in the recent past. It was him. It was Xenos. And a boop. And there's a boop, boop, boop. No, it must have been, I don't know, some kind of really convincing imposter. Xenos is dead. He had a great big hole in his neck. We buried him. Cyrelo. Thank you for the four months, G Stutes. G Stutes? I know I could do it. I know. Imagine all the, the hype that'll build for Shadowbringers on Monday if you finish the I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Do I do it? Chat, do I do it? That being said, I gotta lay down this bitch. It's gonna be so hard you can't appreciate it though. True. Oh, true, you're tired and sick. Go sleep. Go sleep, girl. I think I could do it. But I would have to stop once I start getting sleepy. I napped until 11 p.m. and now my life is in shambles, so please. <laughs> okay, I will get through as much as I can. Um, thankfully, tomorrow all my plans aren't until the evening, so if I sleep, it's totally fine. Um, yeah, well, you know what? I have 22k points on the line. So I, um... I'll see, I'll see what we can do. We'll see what we can do. Okay, chat? But that means you have to stay with me. You can't abandon me, okay? Hi, and someone went to the trouble of des desecrating the bastard's grave, remember? Oh. <gasps> Dolls gilded halls. Whatever are you talking about? Is that... The Namo? Oh, Thancred! Thancred, what brings you to the reach? Elfino had me lending a hand at the Sultry, keeping an eye on the rebuilding work rebuilding work and so on, just until operations were up and running. And now that they are, I thought I might look in on you before wending my weary way back to headquarters. Forgive me if I misheard, but is there some suggestion the late Crown Prince could have gotten better? If so, might I suggest a quick look inside his coffin as our first order of business? Ugh, as much as I hate the man, it doesn't feel right defiling his grave. But if it will put this rumor to rest, I suppose we have to. And when there are no curious eyes about if we can manage it. Xenos is buried up at Bloodhow in the locks. His grave was set apart from the others and left unmarked, so as not to upset the locals. Then it shouldn't be too hard to find. Nago, you're in charge until I get back. Why didn't they cremate him? Why didn't they cremate him? I'm back. What what happened? Um. Oh. I'm such a sucker for white hair on Mikote. What if? What if Pepper? What if? What if Pepper had a little? No. Um. So Sarnix, what's happening now is I am streaming until I get to uh, Shadowbringers. Hypothetically. 
Um, Uber. Uber Javier. What if she had a little salt with her pepper? Well, that was like the whole joke before. I really like Tuxedo Cat. So before, Pepper actually did have white in her hair and then I got rid of it. Because I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking, I'm planning. I'm planning out her, her visuals. They don't cream in El Amigo, I guess? I, hello? Oh! My husband's! <laughs> oh fuck, I meant to pick the, the back seat, but that's okay. I guess I'll sit with you. As a man with salt and pepper hair, I get compliments for it all the time. Salt and pepper hair is a good fucking look. Cremation would have been a good idea, but not local custom, I guess. Yeah, I guess not. I think I recall them talking about what their customs for death were, but like, I don't remember. I don't remember. I think I'm going to swap off of Dark Knight because once again, the level is getting a little too high for my liking. So I'm going to stay on Astro for a bit, I think. Maybe I can do some leveling on Astro. Or no, maybe Dragoon. Maybe I can finally play some Reaper. Uh, maybe Dragoon. No, we'll do Astro. I wish this game would let us pick a different color for hair and eyebrows. I know, yes. So my hack for that is to use the eyebrow tattoo and just put the black tattoo on your face. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, it's right here. Good job, me. This is it. Gods, he'd better be in there. Someone scrawled all over the stone a while ago, but I had scrubbed it off. I had it scrubbed off and thought no more about it. So no one thought to check if the coffin, the coffin was still occupied? Well then, we are presented, we're presented with but one course of action, and we had best be sure we are not observed in the doing of it. Shall we begin? Oh, this is getting so spicy. Oh dear. We seem to be missing a corpse. No shot. No shot. Not the lightning and thunder. <laughs> well, it must be somewhere. I only hope it isn't walking around. I thought that was Kryl for a second, but then I saw the, the thingy. Allison, I'd like to fuck. Frankendale! <sighs> Ashenstein. <laughs> it's three crabs in a trench coat! If there's no corpse, then are we to conclude the rumors are true? Not necessarily. We might still be dealing with a doppelganger of some kind. An agent could have been sent to dispose of the body in a bid to lend credence to the tale of Xenos' resurrection. More and more, however, I find myself siding with Alfino's theory of Asian possession. Speaking from experience, I can tell you they have no qualms about taking a living host, let alone a dead one. You're saying an Asian is walking around in Xenos' body. It seems a distinct possibility. Whoa! Once I put this grave back the way we found it, I shall pay a visit to the people responsible for in interring the crown prince. Before leaping to any conclusions, I want to know for sure if a body was ever buried here, and how certain we are that Xenos was properly dead. If he wasn't, that was some trick. He as good as cut his own head off. Anyway, Roban needs to hear about this. If you find anything out, send word to me at Relicor's Reach. I don't know why I'm surprised. With matters settling down in Doma, we were due another crisis. Shall we make for the Rising Stones, then? It's past time we shared these developments with the others. I need your theories? Hold on, hold on. Oh, the eyebrow hack doesn't work? No! 
Try making your eyebrows as small as possible. Like, pick one of the smally, small, small ones. So my theory... Oh, man. I do kind of dig the idea of, like, of like an Asian, um using his body as, like, a host. Um... Maybe... No, I was gonna say maybe with the use of ether it helped. Help restore him to some degree. Who was the person who took the was the Asian who took the mask off? Was that Asahi? Was that meant to be Asahi? Because whoever that was, I feel like has something to do with Xenos. No? I feel like that person has something to do with Xenos then. Um, am I in 4.4 .4 now, by the way, or am I in 4.3 still? While I was waiting for you to arrive, I spoke with Urianje over Link Pearl and gave him a full report. Ishtola is on her way and should be here any- Ah. Uh. <laughs> mommy? Is mommy here? Oh, but this is the end? Okay. Elise, Pepper, tis good to see you safe and well. What news have you from the east? Well, girl, let me fucking tell you about the nonsense I just dealt with. Disturbing developments indeed. Given all that we know, I too will conclude that Anasia now inhabits Xenos' body. A doppelganger might fool the pr crown prince's subordinates, but Pepper? Nay, Alfino had the right of it. Would that his wisdom extended to the question of his own safety? Capable though he be has bleh. capable though he has become, his ventures alone into the enemy's stronghold and the shadowy web of the paragons like as not. Oh, Pepper doing a think. When it comes to making rash decisions, I'm hardly in a position to criticize, but I'm worried. I just wish there was something I could do besides pray. Me too, girl. Me too. Oh. Meanwhile? Are we getting a meanwhile moment? Meanwhile in the Imperial Palace. We cannot suffer icons to exist. Was I not clear on this point? More than clear. The icon in question was sum summarily dispatched by the Warrior of Light. The summoner is dead and the right beyond the right beyond repeating. Everything proceeded according to plan, every party behaving exactly as required. My methods may seem extreme, but there's no cause for concern. I work only to ensure the salvation of this star. Hmm. Is this gonna be Sid and them, or is this Alfie arriving? What is this? It looks like imp oh, it's this person. Oh no, this is somebody else. Hmm? What are you doing fiddling with that thing? Are you gonna kill him? I asked you a question, soldier! What are you? Have you lost your mind? <laughs> Gee whiz. I 
have lost many things, but my mind is yet my own. There upon the stage I stood, prepared to take my final blow. Bow. Bow! My final bow! Only to find that the finale was but an intermission. <laughs> Shall I use this chance to repent for my sins? Embrace goodness and mediocrity? Nay, I think not. While the one I yearn to face yet lives, the hunt must go on. Looking at his eyes, I was like, Orshifa? But... Hello? <laughs> no, I think I'll cause problems instead. Relatable, bud. Who the fuck is this? Who is this? So he's a goose. Emissary of the Dawn. With thoughts of Alfino's plight weighing heavy on her mind... Alize might welcome some company. It's been an eventful few days, hasn't it? But I suppose all we can do now is wait wait for word from Alfino. Hm, I don't recall the last time I had nothing pressing to be getting on with. You should probably make the most of it. Should I put on some tea? Tea would be lovely. You may regale me uh, with a tale of your adventures in the Far East, and of your encounter with this new primal especially. All geese are terrible, it's true. Canadian geese especially. I'll put the kettle on then. That table looks free if you'd like to take a seat. Oh! 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 Upon sitting at the table, several cutscenes will play in sequence! Ooh. Ah! 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 It is recommended that you set aside sufficient time to view these scenes in their entirety. Ah! It's happening! It's happening! Things are happening! Things are happening! Things are in um, motion! Okay. Okay. Alright. Okay. 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 Things are happening. Things are going. Alright. Go take a poop. Go grab a drinky. Go grab a snacky. Go grab a blanky. Because I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to go pee pee. Alright. I'll be right back. <laughs> Girl, it's almost 1 a.m. I don't give a fuck. You're sitting here with me watching this shit.
Okay, chat. Are we ready? Where is my chat? Where is my chat? Chatterinos? Chatteroonies? Where are you all at? We're all ready? I don't think I am. I'm kind of I'm kind of scared. All right, if you're ready, let me see some popcats in the chat. Come on. Show me the popcats. I want to see them. Not a poop cat. Not the poop cat. All right. Okay. 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 My controller is all tangled up. Bitch needs to charge. My headset is all tangled too. There we go. All right. Okay. Do I get cozy with the lights off? Should I get cozy with the lights off? I get cozy with the lights off. Watch my stream DC in the middle of the soul. <laughs> Interesting. So the Sukuyomi- Sukuyomi- FUCK! That's fine. That's right, they believe their gods or kami reside in physical objects. <laughs> Given the danger they represent, it may behoove us to begin a cat- Who the fuck says behoove? Behoove us to begin a catalog of such relics. But if we are to contain the threat, we will require a better understanding of the summoning method itself. I pray- I, I believe I shall pay a visit to the Doma and learn what I can on the subject. A fine idea. I know for a fact that our friends in Doma would be grateful for any information which could help to prevent further summoning in the region. I will pen you a letter of introduction. Lord Hien will wish to welcome our resident expert on etherology. Greetings! Could it be that I'm in time for tea? It certainly looks that way. Come on, sit down and tell us uh, how your investigations went. After you left, I went about questioning Bloodhow's gravekeepers. They all told much the same story. Once Lisa and her officers had confirmed Zeno's dead, his corpse was in interred. And in is it interred? Like interrogate? Interrogate? Inter? Interred? Interred? Uh, under strict suspicion. So supervision. There seems little reason to doubt their testimony on that point, but when I mentioned the defacement of Zeno's grave, accounts grew rather more vague. None reported having seen any suspicious persons of vicinity, and all assumed the act to have been perpetrated by a vengeful Alamegan. Crucially, however, I was able to confirm that when the, off when the offending scrawl was removed, as per Lisa's instruction, no one involved thought to check the contents of the coffin. By that stage, tis like that the corpse was already missing. Assuming Xenos has not, in fact, risen from the dead, we are left with two possibilities. Either the body was disposed of to lend credence to the claims of an extremely committed imposter, or an Asian has taken up residence within it. If Asahi was as fervent as 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 fervent as as fervent a devotee as you believe, devotee, I guess, he would not have been fooled by an impersonation, however committed. He must we must assume that we are dealing with an Asian and proceed accordingly. Agreed. The question is, how many more mo such monsters are waiting for Alfino and Garlemald? The presence was his chief reason for going. I'm getting scared. He understood the risks. I only hope he did not underestimate the extent of the infestation. Oh gods, I hope Alfino is okay. If anything happens to the twins... God... Meanwhile, on the Imperial Hypersonic Assault Craft LXXV. <laughs> That's the title. Hmm. 
Master Elf, you know, we are making good speed towards our destination. Is Optimus? Nay, it is just I can see not from my cabin. I was curious to know the land over which we flew. Ah, I'm afraid our military craft are built with little thought for such niceties. I am happy to indulge your curiosity, however. We are presently passing over the burn of the on the western edge of Authard. Even with the benefit of a porthole, your gaze would have been greeted with naught but malms upon malms of lifeless earth. I've read something of the burn. It was described as a desolate wasteland, blood dry of every last drop of ether. Aye, it is believed that a succession of icon summonings was responsible. When Emperor Solus first- I cannot say that without thinking of literally Solus. When Emperor Solus first came to Authord and beheld this blight, he is said to have reeled at the scale of the devastation. He declared icons a threat to our very star's existence and issued an empire-wide decree ordering the eradication of all such entities. Hmm? Report! We're under attack, sir. Magitek armor. No visible de designation? Designation? Magitek? But who? Mm. All cannons. Return fire. Damage report. The main reactor's been hit. Helm unresponsive. We're going down, sir. Alfie, no! Damn it! They knew exactly where to hit us. All hands. Brace for impact. Glad to have you back, Master Alfino. We have landed in one piece, more or less. But the air filtration system is damaged, and the ship is filling with smoke. We must gather the survivors and get out while we still can. Aye. Aye. I'm going into a duty? All right, give me one second. Why am I going into a duty? One sec, sorry. Sorry. Okay. What? Master Alfino, might I ask you to search for survivors? I will see to our injured helmsman. What? I'm playing as Alfie? 
wait. Oh, did I just lose my Alfino hotbar? Wait, where'd my, wait, where'd my Alfino hotbar go? Wait, wait a minute. I was gonna ask. Oh no, I was gonna. I was gonna ask if he was an astro, and then I realized R one. Oh, just oh okay yes okay oh he's a scholar I thought he was a summoner because he's got a carbuncle okay all right uh, destroy the airship wreckage okay I guess <laughs> wow wow I am I am um We found somebody. Oh my god! <laughs> Bonk! <laughs> Bonk! Bonk! Look, I'm a pro gamer, okay? I know what I'm doing. Wait, oh, is he not- is he still dead? Sorry, bud. I got you. <laughs> my thanks. I don't think I would have made it. I got you. Yes, you very likely saved his life. The question of who would try to take it remains, however. Put these last few out of their misery. The prince wishes none left alive. What? The prince? They've not come to parlay, I fear. Ready your weapons. Um, do I only know these four abilities? What does Tri Shackle do? I'm so glad I have swift cast. Oh my god, you do a lot of fucking damage. Oh, I guess my carbuncle does a good amount too. What does shining moonstone do? Empowered by the light of the moonstone increases damage. Oh! Okay, okay, okay. I got this. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Little baby. How did y'all miss? How did you miss that? Confound it. Not here. Not like this. Got her, they got the five gifted, I appreciate it. Muted my alerts. Who the fuck is this? What? Who in the Emperor's name? Enemies of our enemies. Introductions can wait. You are calm in a crisis, Master Alfino. Let's finish this then.
to anybody who got gifted silver, welcome to your bedroom on Saturday. Stay! Alright. Oi, oi, oi. I thought that said stoned Lancer. I was like, damn, wish that were me. abilities that like that chick and like Gaius or Z Z Z no whatever the fuck whatever I, I know those abilities I hate that shit <laughs> there are more there are more there are more there are more yeah oi oh no what is happening? Oh, I have my limit break. Should I use that? I feel like I may have to. Ooh. Ooh, can I get them all with this? Will they all be affected by this? Watch me miss every single one of them. Hey. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Oh, I guess that helped like broke the chain, break the chains. I guess. Oh, we're done. We're done. My thanks. Your intervention proved most timely. <sighs> Why is he kind of hot? Well, well, I did not think to meet an Eorzean in this place, let alone a Scion. You know of me, sir? this Lavellin looking ass? I have some small history with your order. But I would speak of the present. Know, your assail know you your assailants and the severity of your predicament? The soldiers bore the insignia of the Emperor's personal guard. And I could venture a guess as to their motive, but you yet have us at a disadvantage. Sir, will you not let uh, tell us who you are? This Lavellin looking ass? Look at them! Our names are not yours for the asking, and as for your purpose, let this be your answer. <gasps> the face of our prey. It looks like a Lavellan! Like an elf from- Not just a Lavellan, sorry, an elf from Dragon Age. Yeah, it's a Dragon Age thing. <laughs> We must away before more arrive. Come with us or stay, but make your choice now. Even should we manage the long trek out of the burn and secure passage to the capital, we would no doubt be greeted by the Emperor's guard. Indeed, we accept your gracious offer. Uh... Shadowhunter will suffice for the present. Am I gonna bring you the shadows that you hunt? Come.
There's a lot of cum in this game. on his belt or under his belt but I feel like I'm supposed to know who that is Ugh, this is intolerable but as much as I wish it were otherwise there's nothing we can do for Alfino now but pray for his success well that is not entirely true while your brother journeys to Garlemald from the east I can make my way there from El Amigo and find out what there is to be learned in the Empire's western provinces then I'm coming with you. I can't very well sit here sipping tea if there's action to be taken. Forgive me, Alize, but the provinces are hostile territory, and stealth is all important. It is safer that I go alone. I can sneak well enough when the situation demands it. Don't patronize me. We should leave this Thancred. I'll go with him. I'll go with him. And how exactly would that be any better? <clears throat> I must refuse your company as well, my friend. Formidable though you are, the success of my mission depends on moving unnoticed. And unless you forget, you have grown rather famous. I trust you understand. I guess... I guess I'm a little famous. <sighs> Fine, just promise you'll be careful. It seems that praying is to be the extent of my contribution, after all. But I will stay behind, as I have been bid. Then all have our ta we all have our talents. Mine just happened to involve a silver tongue and soft soles. Oh! Oh, because he's a smooth talker and he's quiet. Oh, I- my mind went immediately into him, um, licking feet. And I got a little too excited by the thought of that. I am ashamed. I am so ashamed. I am so ashamed. Wh what? He said he had a silver tongue and soft soles. I <laughs> Look. Look. It's 1 a.m. and I'm down bad. Okay? She here wanting someone to lick her feet. Get on your knees, Jin. Get on your fucking knees. I know you would. Oh, now it's <laughs> Stop! Over Thancred? Yeah! Let me have this. Let me have this. I promise it's on a word the moment I learn aught of, our, of consequence. See that you notify me too. I mean to depart for Doma as soon as I find a suitable East Aldenard, Aldenard vessel. To bear me thither, 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 I hate that word, thither, but I shall return if I am needed. Be sure to drop in whenever you're next in the area, Pepper. With any luck, I'll have a painfully detailed report from Alfino to share. Ponder. I got ponder. Ponder window. I have learned the emote ponder. Give me it. Give me it. Oh, that's cute! <gasps> Are we on 4.4 now? A new chapter of New Game Plus has been added. Dentist! Thank you for the 10 gifted subs. I appreciate it. I know I missed something else too. Gamergen, thank you for the sub as well. Thank you. Oh good, I didn't miss uh, 4.4. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? The midnight train is gay! Thank you for the 100 biddies to satisfy. Thank you. Alrighty, my alerts have been turned back on. We're good now. Sisterly act. Eliza is impatiently fussing with her link pearl. Oh, Pepper, if you've come here hoping for news, I'm afraid there isn't any. Everything is exactly as it was. Ishtola is still investigating primals in the Far East. Thancred is still gathering intelligence in the Imperial Provinces. 
And Alfino is still out there somewhere. There's been no word since his first scheduled report, nor does he respond to calls. And all the while, I'm just meant to sit around here waiting. It's driving me mad. Begging your pardons? I bear a message from the Orazine Alliance. Thank the gods for that. We have a visitor. Welcome to the Rising Stones. If you have a message, I should be e most eager to hear it. My lady, the Alliance leadership will soon convene to discuss the matter of Asian interference, and they humbly request the presence of the Scions of the Seventh Dawn. Having assessed intelligence provided by the Alamegan resistance concerning the whereabouts of Xenos' remains, they too suspect Asian involvement and wish to deliberate a suitable course of action. As the foremost authorities on your foe, your orders council your orders council would be most welcome. Of course, we should be glad to assist in whatever way we can. With almost everyone else afield, I'd say this one falls to us. By which I mean, I'm not going on my own. You'll come with me, I trust? Of course I will. Without a doubt! There you have it. We accept the invitation. Thank you. The time and date of the meeting will be shared in due course, but I can confirm that the council will take place in Alamigo. Fire leave. I keep, like, playing with my hair, and then it keeps getting frizzier and frizzier and frizzier. I somehow doubt we'll have anything useful to offer, but standing mutely at a meeting would still be better than nothing. I'm doing, but then the nothing I've been doing of late. Let's make ready to depart, shall we? Thancred? What's going on, man? All right, just be careful on the road back, you hear? Did I hear it right, Riol? Is Thancred coming back? Aye, that he is, since he's acquired some important intelligence. Being in Garlean territory, though, he couldn't risk sharing the particulars in case the Imperials were listening in. So he said he'd be back as quick as he could, and to make sure someone was waiting for him in the Alamegan Quarter. Understood. Pepper and I will go. We're bound for Alamigo anyway, and there's sure to be time before the council begins. Come on, let's be off. Yes, Mommy. <laughs> we are making progress with the plot. Alamegan Quarters. Alright. Why is it called Sisterly Act? What is Alize going to do? I know Ishtola is also a sister. What is she going to do? Is the Rising Stones a euphemism for what happens when it gets cold? No! Oh. 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 Hello? Why was that so immediate? Why did they like immediately look at me? <laughs> oh, I got head pads! Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. No, wait, wait. There. I give kiss. Okay, bye. Oh, did I get a kiss too? What's that? Oh. I got a kiss. I got a kiss. I got a kiss. Bye. Oh, I get another kiss. I gobble it up. Okay. Yum. All right, which fucking way am I going? This is a dead end. It is not. This is surely, it is not. I am going the right way. Oh, it's you. Oh, thank you for the kisses. And thank you for the head pats. Wouldn't want me to mess up that pretty face, now would you? You look the same. You both look like Majin Boo. <laughs> Into it. 
Okay, where the fuck am I going? Are they flirting? I don't know what they're doing there. Oh yeah, the drunk person throwing up. Still there, bud? Hi, husband. Me too, or a cypher sore eyes. Now all I need is water for my parched throat. Fetch me a cup, will you? Um, is it traipsing? Try. I know this word. But I can't say it. Through Imperial Territory is thirsty work. <gasps> I get hit, pants. Oh, is it a cutscene? Oh. Oh, god damn. Uh, god, I needed that. I did too. What? I won't bother telling you to catch your breath. Whatever brought you galloping back to us, I assume it's urgent. Quite. Without further ado, then. After the successful uprisings in Doma and Alamigo, rebels in several other provinces were inspired to follow suit. Unfortunately, they did not fare quite so well. The Dalmascans paid the heaviest price. For their defiance, the Emperor made a show of raising their capital to the ground, prompting many of their neighbors to abandon thoughts of resistance. But not all have given up on liberty. Heartened by the news of Doma's prisoner exchange, the some raid. still believe that the Empire Hello. may one day be amenable to negotiation. We have the Shinobi to thank for spreading the good word. They have worked tirelessly to keep the subjugated informed, and a little knowledge can go a long way. There is at least a spark of hope then. A spark in want of kindling, yes. The Alliance has already begun supplying materiel to resistance movements abroad, many of whom would otherwise struggle to continue the fight. The support effort has been led by the Sultana and the Elder Seedseer, who have both seen enough Alamegan refugees to know the consequences of oppression. And for their troubles, they have quickly earned a reputation as folk heroes in certain corners of the Empire. I appreciate this update, but it's not what that I anticipated. Is all for the provinces. As for the Garlean motherland there itself... There we go. There it is. Our friends, the Populares, have suffered something of a setback, I regret to say. Talk is rife that Doma has summoned a primal, and the Empire's more liberal voices are being drowned out in the fearful clamor for retribution. And who did they think orchestrated this summoning? <laughs> oh, any but those truly responsible. Xenos has seen to that. Speaking of whom, the Crown Prince is recovering remarkably well. Mm. Well enough, in fact, to enable him to personally tour the provinces. Ah? Putting the fear of the Emperor into the hearts of any would-be dissidents. What? He walks in plain sight, and none suspect him. Then it's as we feared. Yes. And Assian wears his skin. But it was not that which brought me here in such haste. During my time in the provinces, I learned many things. Yet at no point did I hear any report of a Doman emissary in the capital. But Alvano should have arrived by now. Could they be holding in there in secret? The possibility did cross my mind, but I have reason to believe he never reached his destination. As you know, Scions assigned to covert operations, such as Riol and myself, are issued special link pearls for communication in the event of an emergency. I mention this because it was originally Alfino's task to coordinate the response at headquarters, meaning he has one. And whose voice should I hear when mine recently crackled to life? You spoke with Alphano? Spoke with? No. I but heard his voice, and none too clearly at that. Two words were all I could make out. The burn. 
The wasteland on the edge of Othherd. Something must have happened to them there. <laughs> There's no time to waste. We must make for the burn at once. The burn. <laughs> I had a feeling you might say that. And? I can't very well sit around here drinking tea if Althano's in trouble. You said yourself that this link pill was only to be used in emergencies. So I'm going, and that's the end of it. Oh, honey bunny. Sugar plum booby trap. Booby trap? And I'm going to. I presume is what Pepper would have said. Oh, well, far be it from me to change your minds. How much fucking tea does she drink? Look, what's wrong with drinking a lot of tea? I also drink a lot of tea. Tea's good. Though, though I am to neglect men making preparations for the council, we must act swiftly before Alfino's trail goes cold. I propose we, pay, we first pay Hien a visit. He sh he's sure to want to hear about these developments, and he may well be able to advise us on how best to reach the burn. A sound plan, and he stole us in Doma, is she not? I guess I should join you in the search if you asked her nicely. Well, you see to all that, I shall go and report my findings to the Alliance. You may leave any preparations for the Council to me. Thank you, Thancred. Right, to Doma then. We have much more to share with you, Stola. Alrighty, and now I gotta teleport there. Like so. Oh, thank you for the kisses. Thank you for the kisses. Oh no, that's Dolly is them. Is it not? Is it not? Now I feel like I'm losing my marbles. That it is. That's Dolly. Right? Hi! Hello! Isn't it not? Is it not? <laughs> Am I insane? How are you all still literally here? How is everyone literally still here? Are you all just following me? Hmm, mommy Stola. My wife! Hmm, that is curious indeed. But other matters demand my attention at present. I shall bear what you have told me in mind. Should you notice any change, do not hesitate to seek me out. Thank you, my lady. You are most kind. Oh, true. She can't. No, it's okay. Well, well, see faces from the dim and distant past. Come now, it hasn't been that long. Who was that you were speaking with? A local miner who supplies crystals for the rebuilding effort. Of late, he claims to have struggled to find a crystal with so much as a trace of elemental energy. Upon learning that I had, upon learning that I had some knowledge of ether, he came seeking my counsel. Just now, he brought me one of his recent finds. It was precisely as he described, devoid of elemental energy and eerily reminiscent of the de-aspected, 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 uh, crystals that manifest in Eorzi in the days prior to the calamity. You would be wise to investigate the phenom this phenomenon more closely. Indeed, but on a more positive note, the locals seem to have taken a liking to you. <laughs> more an interest in than a liking to, I think. The sight of a Mikote with a peculiar contraption upon her head has a certain novelty value in these parts. <laughs> Any actual regard they may have for me, I owe wholly to you and the others who came before. Everyone here has been exceedingly cooperative, and I am pleased to report that I have all but concluded my investigation. Simply put, by focusing one's will upon an ether-infused ether object of worship, it is possible to conduct a summoning. So the fact that they are objects of worship is the key? They are themselves suffused with the requisite belief? 
Correct. Such sacred relics as the Kojin collect obviate the need for religious fervor in the summoner, Yotsuyu being the most obvious example. She had but to associate the artifact given to her by Asahi, the divine, and it served to amplify her desires and give them form. A form nourished through the powers of crystals, also provided by her brother, and thus was Suko Sukuyomi brought into being. What is happening? I feel like swapping, so I need a carpenter. <laughs> what are you making Vosk make for you? Oh, <gasps> wait, that's Dolly and Dolly Shy are not the same person. This whole time, this whole time. Wait, I knew that because Dolly has been in the. I am but a fool. I am but a fool. This is the greatest name in the history of the other day. Someone named Ustola's litter box. Stop! No, that's so bad. That is so bad. One sec. All is well. Which brings me to the question of uh, prevent preventative, yeah, preventative measures, to which I have yet to find a satisfactory answer. At present, I know of naught that will avail us, save to keep watch over the movement of relics and crystals, as if we did not have enough to keep watch over already. Dun dun dun! But I doubt you came all this way to hear that which may be pre perused in a report. Has something happened to Elfino? You know? Girl, let me tell you a story real quick. Hmm. I should join you in the search, of course. Thank you, Stola. I should be glad of your help. Truly. Now, if there is nothing else, I shall go on ahead and request an audience with Lord Hien. And now we're gonna talk shit about her. Hallie's ape puts on a brave face, but she has little talent for concealment. We should join her at the Kian Khan. Mm. <laughs> mm. Wait. These schools with litter boxes nowadays for these furries? What? Are you the authority on what's bad, Miss Thancred loves feed? Look. What? Why are you kink shaming um people with foot fetishes, huh? So what? So what if Thancred likes feet? I will keep the sweat in between my toes if he would want to lick them off, okay? If he likes a little extra flavor on his feet, I got him. I got him. Lord Hien is expecting you. May I show you in? What? 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 Chat. Come on. Come on. You wouldn't do the same? You're telling me if your precious Yatsuyu wanted your sweaty feet in her mouth, you'd say no? Who is kissing me? It, I'm assuming it's Jin. I thought it would be Jin. And then I turn and I see him. Oh, say less? Yeah, that's what I thought. So Orshavon's ghost is weeping at this. No! No! Leave my husband out of this. Leave my deceased husband out of this. Y'all act like you only eat freshly showered pussy. Oh my god. <gasps> Boss, thank you for the kissies. I've known her so Wait, guys, relax. Sarah has streamed this consistently since I've known her, so just let her say what she wants. For sure, it's just a phase. Yeah. Just a phase. Just a phase. Yeah. What could possibly go wrong? 
Okay. I'm getting so many kisses. Oh my god. Uh, oh my god. Uh, they never told me orgies would be this nice. <laughs> Greetings, my friend. Alize has explained all to me. Needless to say, you shall have our full cooperation in the search, even if Alfino's trail does lead to, <laughs> to the burn of all places. We all have a foot phase? No. I... I've never been into feet. I like hands, though. <laughs> and noses. Alright. How many quests do I have left? Uppies! I want uppies! Uppy, uppy! Give me uppies! Oh, wait. Like, like, uppy up, not like an uppy. Like, not uppies. Click him so I can see the title. Sure. Feel the burn. Isn't this, um, controversial in America? Feel the burn? I have 13 left. Ugh. What do I have? I have what, Jin? I have this? I have this? Can you say that again? What is it that I have? Okay. You have amazing uh, eyes. Stop it. The region known as the Burn occupies a special place in Garlean history. Every child in the Empire is familiar with the tale. In the distant past, it was a verdant land teeming with life, but successive summonings saw blood dry of ether and reduced to a desert. It was upon beholding the devastation that primals had wrought that primals had wrought that Emperor Solus was spurred to embark upon his crusade against their kind. The Burn offers a glimpse of the future we seek to prevent. Know you of any reason why Alfie No might have gone there? Aye, mischance. Though it lies on the route to Garlemald, it is no place to make a stop. My guess is they encountered some manner of trouble there. In any event, I am of the same mind as Alize. We have no choice but to take our search to the burn. Given the considerable distances involved, his best we went by bird. Pepper and I have our yules. Yugiri, will you ready falcons for the others? I shall gather our swiftest birds. Near the House of the Fierce, there's an overlook. Pray join us there once you have seen to your preparations. Ye. <laughs> this is the This is where we just keep saying only come request left till Sire hits Shadowbringers in like three hours. No, literally, I can see that happening. I can unfortunately see that happening. Yes, Jin? Better hurry up, I'm TPing. All right, you missed a shot. I'm not loopy. I would have done that louder, but my neighbors are asleep and I don't want them to think that I'm being murdered. Is that my Uber? <gasps> Vosk, are you gonna be my Uber? You're not even in the party. I'm not even in a party. <gasps> Sorry, Vosk. My other Uber's here now. Dentist, thank you for the 10 gifted subs. I appreciate it. Everybody gives a sub. Welcome to the Japanese Western Day. Um, good north, babe. It's right here. It's, um, it's, um, it's, um, it's, um, here. 2810. This is all because she said she would suck some dentist fingers. This is true. Ever since I said I would suck my dentist fingers, dentist came and came in hot. I'm now halfway to my goal. Your goal is to give me 300 subs? You know it resets in a few days, right? 
It resets in five days. <laughs> where, where do I... You couldn't even take me all the way up? You couldn't even take me all the way up? Do you see this shit? Oh, a thousand gift- You've gifted me 500 subs? Dentist. What are we at, now that I think about it? Let me check what our sub count is. Or our sub points, rather. Are we getting closer? Are we getting closer? We're at 649. 1,000... Minus 649. We need 351 more subs... To unlock a new emote slot. Come on. All right. Wait, what is this? What are you giving me? What is this? What is, what is he giving me? What is this? Ample appreciation. Oh, what is this? Oh, I couldn't use that. You learned the emote wow? I learned a wow? What's wow? Is it that? Wait, that was so cute. Wait, where'd it go? Wait. Wait, that was so... Where is it? There it is. Oh, that's so fucking cute. Are you shitting me? Oh, that's so cute. Girl, I'm on controller. I'm not gonna walk up and type in wow. That walk up I meant reach forward. That's so cute! Do I have anything I can replace that? Replace with the, uh... No, not really. Mm. I don't really give people head pads. They give me head pads, so I'll replace those. Where'd it go? I lost it. Wow! Wow! Okay. If everyone is here and possessed of a bird, let us away. Remember, our destination is a barren- Wow, thank you! Is a barren wasteland- it's barren wasteland. There's no civilization to speak of for a hundred moms in any dire in all directions. Take care you do not lose your way. <gasps> the barn! Oh, that's why you're all here in a party. I see. It all makes sense now. I'm understanding. It's all coming together. Mm -hmm. Not bad. The barn! I'm so sure I have to walk to the keyboard. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> okay. Were we getting a cutscene too? <gasps> I have no more drinking. Thank you for the um. Make ready, friends. We are come to the burn. Where you can. We must wait out the storm. Oh, this music. Oh, this music. Oh god, okay. It's huge! I'm sure you don't get that often. Sorry. I hope I didn't overwhelm you with that comment. Wait, this track?
my god, oh 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 my god, oh
items. Oh, okay. Hello, Forsaken Bot. Thank you for subscribing. What's up? Hello. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. That was unexpected. God damn. Why are you bullying him? You're one to talk about showing off. Every single time you play any class, you're like, look what I can do. Look what I can do. Look what I have. Look what I have. Look at me. Look at me. I'm Sarnix. I got big dick energy. Wowie, wowie, zowie. You have so many plushies? I do. I do have a ton of plushies. I like plushies. I don't know if it's a trauma related thing or what. But I, I do hoard a fair amount of plushes. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. I don't like that. I did not like that. I did not like that at all. That's a big tunnel. Oh. Oh. I can stand up here? use that phrase for the rest of my life. Wowie wow wowie wow. wow, wow. <laughs> big dick energy leads to big dick injur injury and we don't want that. We don't want that at all. We need the dicks operating at all times. But I mean, look, sometimes if they're not operating, that's also fine. We make do, right? for ERB? <laughs> yes, you absolutely can. And CJ too, I think. Look, we support the hustle, okay? No shade. What? What? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try using this. I don't remember how to use it, but Godspeed. Oh, come. Oh, he's gone. He is not gone. I'm, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use that now and I'm gonna hope it does something. That. No. Blank rock miners. <laughs> um, um, um. Good lord. Okay, so that ability damages all of us, and it does look quite a bit. It is quite a chunky. Pepper that ouchies? What did I do? I didn't mean to ouch you. My party's bullying me. I don't like it. Oof, 
I'm being targeted. I'm being targeted. This is harassment. He come on me again. I think right here is good. Oh, there's a lot happening here. My butthole fucking busted. I don't like this. Tell them you play a healer to make them back. <laughs> Look, I'm not that dominant, okay? I play a healer so I can get head pats. Tank, on the other hand. <laughs> Oh, that's so pretty. What is that? <laughs> oh no. That's a uh, that's death man. Stuff. That? But it's pretty. It looks like a dead spiky fella. I like it. I want to put it in my home. I should get head past the amount of class. True. True. I just want to collect head pads from a bunch of cuties. And kiss a bunch of cat boys. It's that simple. And bunny boys. And bunny girls especially. I motorboated a, a Viera bunny. Viera bunny. A Viera girl the other day. It was nice. Dude, this dungeon is gorgeous. I know there's a, it's supposed to be like sand, but it looks like snow and I love it. I love this dungeon. Hmm, don't like that though. Oh no 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 you're okay you're okay you're okay you're okay all is fine all is well Isn't this like oh I fucked it up but isn't that like block damage right it's like a shield I need to use those. That's fine. Hi, Richie! How are you? Hello! Was it Lou? No, it was not Lou. I haven't played with Lou since Heaven's Ward. She don't play with me. <gasps> Well, god damn! I'm- okay, look, I'm a dragon fucker, okay? Dragons are so fucking hot. Dragons are so sexy. I don't know why, they just are. God fucking damn. Oh, I already used that. Shit. Great, cool. 
Destroy it! Thank you. Oh, it's hurting. It's hurting. It's hurting. It's fine. What? 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 Do we just... Do we just... I did not predict that well. I want to figure out that ability. I think it's like a big heal. Oh shit, am I like just mass healing Jin? Fuck! I went to heal myself! Unreliable healer. Unreliable healer. I got this. I do not have this. I have no- I have no mana. I have no mana. I could not res even if I wanted to. And I'm frozen! And it's so- it's so close to dying! Just live it, break! Just live it, break! Oh! There we go! <laughs> No deaths. First try. No deaths! No deaths. I didn't die. They didn't die. No one died. No one died. That was easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Easy. <laughs> okay, phew. Oh, he do a bow? Oh, he do a bow? Oh, thank you. Uh, good lord. No death run, no deaths. No deaths. No deaths. We're gods. Those look like duties. Ah, there you are. <gasps> Zana. Between contending with bloodthirsty beasts and sand in my every conceivable place, I had begun to despair of finding you again. Do you recognize the crashed ship over yonder? Mistress Alizé and I briefly inspected it. It is the vessel that bore Master Alphino away. Shit. 
But there was no sign of him, oh. nor of Maxima and his people. Oh. He's fine, I promise. Why can she see that we can't? So bright. War Machina. It would seem they were involved in a struggle. There may be clues. We should split up and search the area. These were no ordinary soldiers. Over here! The insignia on this man's uniform identifies him as one of the Emperor's personal guard. Hand-picked soldiers, answering only to the royal family. That would explain why all the casualties are Garlean. They were fighting their own. You're saying the Emperor was behind all this? That Alphano is his prisoner? Presumably. We don't know that yet. Alphano is fine, I'm sure of it. Aye, we must not jump to conclusions. Besides, Alphino is more than capable of looking after himself, is he not? I love this lighting. Alize looks so good here. Like her hair complements the sand and her eyes and everything. I suggest we return to Doma to consider our options. That cream Whatever jacket happened has here, got to Master Alphino is long gone, and any subsequent search may safely be left in the hands of the shinobi. Where in the world are you, brother? If you die on me, I will never let you hear the end of it. Am I back in Doma? I am. Do you have a favorite character? I do when he died. <laughs> Um, well, I do, I've, I've always loved Ishtola, I love Hien, um, who else do I like, chat? I love all the four top, uh, family members, um, Hilda's great, I like Kryl, I love those little, like, sylphs, um, I do, I love the twins, I do love the twins. Who else do I love? Oh shit. I'd say our birds would do a good brush down and treat or two, wouldn't you? Oh, they get them snackies. Alright, shadows in the empire. Huh? Huh? I had hoped to steal a moment's rest after our little outing, but it would seem duty calls. Foreign emissary, emissary <laughs> arrived in my absence. Do not let us keep you then. Actually, I was wondering if you might join me. I cannot think of a guest who could fail to be impressed by the presence of the Scions. At least, none I should be happy to receive. Of course, if you think it will be useful. Thank you. Let us return to my manor, then. Alright, chat. Am I getting closer? Am I getting closer, at least? How much more do I have? That was what? Chat, it is 2 a.m. 
It is 2 a.m. Thank you, dentist, for the gifted sub. Hey, Adrian, how are you? <sighs> oh. Do I keep going? Do I keep going? It's, t it's time for Mimi's. It's time for Mimi's. I'm so sleepy. See, I say that I want to go to sleep, but I have the worst feeling that I will just be in bed on Discord all night. <laughs> Call it? Are you sure? It's too late. I know, I will be in bed thinking about it. Lise, what brings you here? Oh, Alliance business. We have a request for Doma, well, Hian. But that can wait. They told me you were out searching for Alphino. Did you manage to pick up his trail? Look at my titties! My shaboongies! God damn! Well, if he wasn't at the crash site, he might still have escaped. We have to keep searching. And we will. Alphino embarked on this journey as an emissary of Dorma, and I hold myself responsible for his safe return. I will have our shinobi in the provinces search for him as a matter of urgency. Chin up, Alize. You'll get to admonish your brother for his recklessness yet. The amount of PMA that they're like well, holding on to, has to for do her it. is so fresh. I'm sure he's going to be fine. There is one thing I'm not sure about, though. You said it was the Emperor's personal guard that attacked Alphino's airship. But the Popularis would never have been able to arrange the prisoner exchange without Varus's blessing. So why would he sabotage his own mission? They may not have been acting on Varus's orders. The guard answer not only to him, but to his family, the Crown Prince included. When Yotsuyu summoned Tsukuyomi, Asahi was quick to proclaim that a dormant citizen had violated the terms of our agreement, that the negotiations had failed. And it is this version of events that is now being repeated across Garlemald. To hear the tale, one would think the prisoner exchange never took place. Plainly, someone is manipulating matters from the shadows. Most likely Xenos, or whoever it is that wears his face. The Shadow Hunter or the Shadow Bringer? Whichever Asian you mean. We all know the nature of our adversary. The servants of Chaos are true to their name. Their meddling has cost Dorma a chance at peace. Whoever it was that loosed his personal guard, the Emperor cannot be ignorant of these developments. <sighs> we must proceed on the assumption that our treaty is indeed in tatters. <sighs> but come, Lise, you have journeyed far. Let me hear your petition. Right. So the big news is that Alamigo has agreed to join the Aeorzean Alliance. Mm. To make it official and discuss where we all go from here, the leaders of the Five Nations are planning to hold a meeting, and we were hoping you might come too. We've already seen what we can achieve when we work together, and the Alliance hopes to work even more closely in future. They think it's our best hope of keeping the Garleans in check, and I agree. As do I. 
By coordinating our efforts in the East and West, we may be able to discourage them from committing their forces to a single front. I accept your invitation. I must, however, ask for time to attend to some pressing matters here. In light of recent events, the risk of Imperial reprisals is greater than ever, and I would not leave Dorma unguarded. Ere I depart, I must shore up her defenses. Understood. I'll let the Alliance know. We'll wait to hear from you before setting a date. The meeting's to be held at the Royal Palace in Alamigo, incidentally. Do you remember the way? Well enough. Please assure my hosts that I will not keep them waiting any longer than I have to. Consider it done. And thank you for agreeing to come. If we all put our heads together, we're sure to find the best way forward. For everyone. She has grown so fucking much. That she's like absolutely rubbing off on me. Like her, like I'm, you know, or rubbing on me, I guess. Rubbing on me? It's too late. I can't form sentences right now. Speak with Hien. Do I speak with him? It's not that I'm having a hard time paying attention to the story. I'm paying attention fine. I'm just having a hard time speaking. You know? <laughs> yeah, rubbing on me is definitely not what I meant to say. Oh. I'll back you either way, but you're... For your health, you should sleep. Wait, for- wait, what? You'll back me? I wanna- I wanna talk with him. I wanna at least complete this. Let me just- let me just- let me just- Because I won't be streaming until... Monday. So... My advisors and I will presently uh, convene to discuss the matter of Doma's defenses. You are welcome to stay, of course. Had you not offered, I would have requested leave to remain. Where the Asians are concerned, not may be left to chance. As ever, we would benefit from your experience. I thank you for coming, Lise, even if it was on official business. I had hoped there might be time to show you the land you helped to save, but I will settle for a fleeting visit if needs must. There never does seem to be enough time for anything, does there? But I did get to see a little of the Enclave. You've made excellent progress, I must say. And soon, you'll have the chance to see how we're getting on, too. Till the meeting, then. Um, Pepper, I was wondering if I might have a word with you before I go. In private. Okay, now that is my cue. That's my cue to go to bed. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should... <laughs> maybe... Maybe I should talk to her, and that'll put me to sleep. Great, I'll wait for you at the docks. Sarnix, what are you blocking? All I can see are all of these terms that you're blocking. Okay. Speak with Lise in the Dolman Enclave. Do I do it, chat? Don't look at the terms? I, how can I not? Do I go to sleep? Or do I talk to Lise? Sorry, next, you don't have to block the terms, just delete the post. If people are posting things that I shouldn't know about, just delete them. You gonna wonder what's next? Yes! I am gonna wonder! It's gonna drive me bonkers! What does she wanna fucking say to me? Is it about Alamigo? Did she discover something? Is it about the alliance? Thanks for coming. Knowing you, you would have you've probably guessed what I wanted to talk about. No! Ali's oh Alize, she's acting as if everything's alright, but it's clear she's barely coping. The Alize I know is overbearing, willful, and reckless, and that's fine. It's how she deals with feeling weak. She has to keep moving or she's afraid she'll fall apart. A lot like me. The thing about people like us is that we need someone to keep an eye on us. I had Papa Limo, and now I have my friends in resistance, and Alize has you in the Scions. 
Before you start, I'm not saying you're neglecting her. Is she about to school me on the way that I comfort my friends that are NPCs that actually don't um, change based on anything that I say to them? Is she telling me how to be a better friend? Is she judging my friendship with Alize? My qualities and my capabilities? I'm sure you aren't and I'm sure you won't, but she's a good friend. And when I sit here like this, I can't help worrying. worrying. So please, make sure you give her all the support she needs, all right? Oh, okay, never mind. Maybe if I kept reading, I would have known that she was not actually bullying me. Hmm. Leave it to me. You have nothing to worry about. Seriously, no. Leave it to me. Thank you, Pepper. It goes without saying, but if there's anything I can do, you only need to ask. Well, I'd best be off. See you in El Amigo. And there she goes. And on that note... No! I'll turn in the quest! I'll turn in the quest! Speak with Hian at K What? You what? <laughs> ah! Wait! Let me turn in the quest! Let me turn it in! Let me turn it in! Look! Look! I gotta turn it in! Speak with Hian at the Kian Con! Look! I just have to turn it in and then I'm done! Am I running the right way? I don't know. It's Mimi's time! But, like, I gotta at least turn in the quest. I have to at least turn it in. No, I'll be I'll be done after this. I promise. See, look, I'm turning it in. Ah, there you are, my friend. Everyone has assembled, so let us begin. Wait, what are we beginning? Wait. Wait. If we are to ready ourselves for invasion, we shall need manpower, provisions, and time, all of which are in notably short supply. Okay. Candid as ever, Yugiri. And correct, I concede. Fortunately, I have an idea. Huh? What's your idea? Tis plain no single nation can stand against the might of the Empire. <sighs> And it was only with the aid of others that Dorma succeeded in winning her freedom. So, I mean to take a leaf out of our Eorzean friend's book and form an alliance of our own. In addition to those with whom we already share an understanding, I would reach out to Hingashi and Suino Sato, and further afield to the myriad peoples of Nangsha and Dalmaska. I am under no illusion. Not all will answer the call. Yet disparate though we may be, we are united in our desire for freedom. Hey. If our neighbors could be made to see what is at stake, Asian machinations and all, cooperation need not be so far-fetched a notion. It may even seem practical. Under the guidance of our former leader, Master Louis Soir, we once strove to unite the fractious city-states of Eorzea. I dare say that experience shall be of use in your endeavor. We should be glad of your wisdom. For the record, I would have been in favor of this plan even if it hadn't been my grandfather's, but I have to ask, how will we secure the time to carry it out? Not that anyone has forgotten. But the Garleans have airships, lots and lots of airships. Should they catch wind of our the plan, panic? they could send an armada to overwhelm us before our alliance had even begun to take shape. No. Not if we deny them access to the skies. During our time in the burn, the warrior of light and I chanced upon some Allegan ruins. When? Oh. When? As such ruins go, oh, they're not particularly unusual. 
But Never something <laughs> about the surrounding land struck me as odd. Faint though it was, I its ethereal residue yeah. is uncannily similar to that of <laughs> Azizla. Identical, mm. in fact. For locations so far removed to share a single etheric signature is all but impossible. I conclude, therefore, that the Allegans created the floating continent with land taken from the burn. While that is a most intriguing theory, I fail to see what relevance it has to Dorma's defense. Aziz La was enclosed in a powerful energy barrier, uh, impenetrable even to oh an Agnes-class yeah! battleship. It occurred to me that those ruins may have enjoyed similar protection. I have no proof, but the Warrior of Light did report seeing a structure resembling other known Allegan field generators. For the credit. All right. But even if we could put up such an energy barrier, it surely wouldn't extend beyond the limits of the burn. So what's to stop the Garleans flying around it? Fuel. The Dalmascan capital, Rabanasta, was a key imperial refueling point in the east. By laying waste to it as a lesson to the rest, the empire greatly hindered its own operations in the region. If an Imperial fleet were to advance upon Dorma, it would now have little choice but to travel, as the crow flies, over the burn. I see. A word of caution. Even assuming the generator still functions, raising a barrier of such a scale will require a prodigious amount of energy. And few places are so bereft of suitable crystals as the burn. Hmm. A source of energy. Tell me, did the Allegans make a habit of launching things into the sky? A curious question. Besides Aziz La, I know of only one other notable instance. The Red Moon Dalamud, whose fall triggered the calamity. Oh. Oh. Just the two occasions, you say? Then I believe I may have a solution to our energy problem. You do? I may. To find out for sure, we would need to visit the Azim Steppe. Which would, I now see, present the perfect opportunity to discuss an alliance with the Zayla tribes. I was wondering why <laughs> oh, he never neat. What considered... Say you? Shall we see whether this road leads? Like, speaking with them? Like the Ora? There was the Zayla tribe, and then there was the other one, right? Like the Dusk Mother, and then like whatever. The Morning Father and the Dusk Mother, whatever it was called. Um... Okay. Now. Now I'm hopping off. Ooh. I want to keep playing. I want to keep playing so bad. I want to keep playing so bad. <laughs> keep going. Stop. <sighs> Stay up as long as you don't- No, you can't say that because I know you mean it. <laughs> no, it's 2.30. I do need to sleep because I need to take my dog out at a reasonable hour tomorrow. And then I have to- I have a lot of shit to do tomorrow. So unfortunately, unfortunately, I, I have no choice but to be strict with myself and actually go to bed. But what this also means is that you will not be seeing me until Monday. I know, I know, I know. We're all used to me streaming very frequently now. Me taking a break is like taboo at this point. But unfortunately, I know. 
Maybe Sunday night I'll go live. <laughs> I did do great. I streamed for six and a half hours, which is very rare. I've been I've I've been doing pretty well, okay? Thank you. Um so I will be back if not Sunday night, just not for main story stuff, just for daily is like a nice casual stream. Then you will see me on Monday, and on Monday, we are going to make it to Shadowbringers, and hopefully, maybe do a quest or two in Shadowbringers. We'll see. I'm determined. Fingers crossed. This is going to roll around, so it's going to be like, I have been up this entire... <laughs> no, but you're so right. You know how many times I'll log off Twitch and be like, alright guys, I'm going to bed, Good night, and then I'm literally up, still playing Final Fantasy? With like Vosk or Jin or something like it's it's pretty bad it's pretty bad all right should we 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 should bring back a raid message right is that something we should do what's our raid message do we have one do we have a cop we do and I don't like it I think what should our raid message be? Because we're going to go say hi to my lovely friend Adrian. But I want to... Wait, does he even... Can we even spam him? What's his chat like? I have no idea. We should be able to. What do we do? Happy faces? Smiley faces? That's the same thing. Do I... I guess maybe like head pats? <laughs> what, yeah, what if we just... What if we just spam head pats? I couldn't stay up, so here I am reading you. Say! Rude! Rude! Okay, yeah. We'll we'll just spam the head pats, alright? Okay, let's go say hi to Adrian. He's playing Tactics Ogre Reborn. I think Yuna... I think Yuna was also playing that when we raided her the other day, I'm pretty sure. So let's go give Adrian some love. Let's go demand some head pats, and I will see you all in the Discord server and on social media, so don't forget to join and follow me on Twitter, Instagram, what have you. Can we get a bump from my Discord and my socials in the chat real quick? I love you all. Thank you for um, enduring this journey with me. I really appreciate it. I didn't do my dailies today, did I? <gasps> Bye! Thank you.